win in life. You will reap what you sow. Simpson, Simpson, what's 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 what? I can't believe you are part. You are part of that in the central bankers. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I am very sorry if you are part of that but I have to attend to those clients. What do you mean by that? Well, like I said, guy, I'm very sorry. But I can't stand to lose those potential clients because of you. Sincerely, I don't never believe you treat me this way. Okay, guy, it's okay. Don't touch me. I am very, very sorry if you are all for Okay? Oh, just chill. Let me attend to them when I finish. I'll come back and then you can do your music. dress up fast so you won't be late for your physiotherapy appointment. Allow me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't want to go find it. Physiotherapy. My princess, the king will have me flog if you miss your physiotherapy appointment with your doctor. Please allow me to dress you up fast. Go away. Go. Lock the door. Okay. I will lock the door. But I won't leave you here alone. You can't stay as long as you're not talking about the ship. <sighs> okay. I won't talk anything about physiotherapy. If that will make you happy. My princess. <laughs> <laughs> My princess. NG baby. <laughs> I'm happy you are happy. Here is Madam Esther's son. Hello, young man. Hello. Michael. Who are you? Um, my name is Godwin. Madam Esther's son. I've never seen you. Well, um, I'm not a, an important personality, so I, I just make up a, a whole lot. But you've been in this village? Uh, yes, yes, my queen. Oh, wow, interesting young man. Uh, you know what, uh, today is not Friday, but trust me, I'm going to pass it like today, it's Friday. You know I don't have any business with Fridays, all right? <laughs> Truly, I don't. I'm going to pass it till Mama calls, like, no, seriously. Mama is not calling. We're here today, so she better not call, because I won't let you put the call. Oh, you want to put me into trouble? You want to get me into trouble? See, Mama will be waiting for me, seriously. She let her wait. She'll wait forever, but for today, Oh, look at my baby. All spicy and hot. You can say that again. Oh, come on, touch the laps again. Fuck it. <laughs> wow. So tell me. Have you ever done threesome before? Oh my god. <laughs> you know, that's what I wish for. You know, like a threesome, guys banging. Bah, bah, bah. You don't want to stop it from behind. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> behaving like an adult that you are. Stop coming to disturb me at my workplace. You have to grow up. You're no longer a child. I'm sorry, Inde. I'm sorry. Yeah, 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 but that's, that's in the past now. What is most important now is the message from the Queen. And what message are you talking about? Ah, please stop acting like you don't know what I'm talking about now. Eh? Well, well, while I was waiting for you at the palace, the Queen met me. And she, she inquired, she asked me what, what uh, I studied in school, my, uh, this thing. Who knows, maybe she wants to offer me a job. Offer you a job? Just like that? Mm -hmm. 
Anyway, my I didn't set my eyes on the queen all through the day. The, uh, if you are taking your calls, I would have come into the palace uh, to wait for you till closing. Who knows, the queen might, might, might uh, see me again and that would have reminded her of her promise to me. Hmm. Sending a message to me to give to you doesn't sound like a promise. It is, oh. Mm. It is. <laughs> Anyways, I will be coming there tomorrow. Maybe my luck will shine. Be working. Stop coming to disturb me at work, please. And we have to take this your job once in serious. You're a man now. You're you're grown up. Stop going to waste your days at that studio singing what I don't know about. I'll come tomorrow. My princess, I was told that you refused to go for your physiotherapy. Yes, mother. Why, my dear? I don't want to go to the therapist again. Did he say or do anything you didn't like? Mm -hmm. I, I forgot to say so. All right. You will go to the zoo, but you will still have to go and see the physiotherapist. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else you want? All right, tomorrow morning, Grace will take you to the physiotherapist. All right? Please, please, please. Grace will take you there tomorrow, all right? Okay. That's my princess. <laughs> That's my princess. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. It's so funny that you don't see your fault in all this. Where is my fault in this? Where? Look, I'd rather not do this with you. But all you right? started it. You don't have to run away from it. You have failed in your duty as a mother. When you should be a shining example in motherhood as the queen of the land. Oh yeah? Yes. What makes you think you don't have the role to play in all this drama that you are orchestrating? Watch your tongue. I will not tolerate any insult from you. I don't care how you feel. You are as guilty as I am in this thing. Very guilty of it. You need to know that. How? First of all, you need to be a father. You are a father to them. I need to remind you that you need to be a father to your children first. Before you father the people that you are ruling. Do I need to remind you of that? I can see how sheepish you are. I call it anything you want. But trust me, I am saying the truth. Please, I need some peace. Oh, good. I want the peace you want. Good morning, my friend. You are still. Sit. 
Thank you. Thank you, my queen. I would like to discuss something important with you. Okay, my queen. Esther. Yes, my queen. I want your son to marry my daughter, the princess of this kingdom. Oh, when he has something, if you can convince him to take my daughter as a wife. I know what you're thinking. How can your only son marry an imbecile? But think about the benefits being an in-law to the king and I. You change your life. Things will be better for you. You could have chosen one of the palace guys, but I chose your son instead. Um, my queen, I, I am quite honored by your offer. But I'm sorry to say this. My son will not get married to your imbecilic daughter. Never. Not even for the whole gold and silver. Stop it! I insult my daughter in front of me. I'm sorry, my queen. Sorry. I think you should leave now. Leave now! Esther is a very blunt woman. Not even my position as a queen will intimidate her. I would rather look for a way around this than have a discuss with her. Because if she turns it down, every other plan may be fail. Actually. My queen, is everything alright? What's the problem? Everything is fine. Okay. I have a request. Okay. I'm listening. It's about your son. My son? Yes. What about him? Is there any problem? Mm, not really, but um, I'm looking for an extra driver for the palace. You know what I mean? Um, personal driver for my daughter, the princess. Ah, my queen. That would have been a great opportunity for my son. Considering the fact that he's not been able to get a job since after school. I mean, all his efforts have had I've been to no avail. I know he's looking for a job. That's why I want to give him this opportunity. Ah, that's so kind of you, my queen. But there is a problem. What's the problem? My son cannot drive. That's not the problem. I can send him to a driving school and have his particulars delivered to me. Really? Ah, thank you so much, my queen. You're so kind. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm very grateful. Thank you. Thank you. You're very kind. Thank you. Thank you. Ayelele, ayelele. Mama le, mama le, 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 le. Pastor, all I need is a platform. And I'll organize everything. Brother Godwin, you're not a gospel singer. How do I let you organize a musical concert in the Church of God? Pastor, I know I'm not a gospel singer, but my songs are not worldly either. Please help my career. Please. Okay, let's do it like this. Why don't you do gospel? All you need to do is just put in that word Jesus there. I mean, a change in your lyrics will do. Pastor, you and I know that I'm not a gospel singer. Even God himself knows this. That I'm not, why, why, would I, why, why, why would I deceive that myself and my audience? Then, then I'm sorry, in that case, I can't help you. can't help you, Brother God. Pastor, gospel singers, as we all know, are ministers of God. All I have is just the talent to entertain and educate my audience. Please, I beg you, help my career. I need uh, just the youths and not the entire church. <laughs> Brother God, we still don't get it. Clearly. Light and darkness cannot mix together. How can we bring the word into the church of the Most High God? We can't do that. But Pastor, this youth we are talking about here do celebrate Valentine's Day. And on Valentine's Day, they will be found in places that the songs will be played. Oh, yes. <laughs> Brother Godwin, I know your intentions are very, very good. But we cannot allow it. 
This Valentine's Day you're talking about, is it even in the Bible? Celebrating it in the church is not godly. Pastor, it's Christmas in the, 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 the Bible. Be careful you, you, you don't blaspheme the name of God. God forbid that I blaspheme against my God. The church might have failed me, but my God will not fail me. Amen, Brother Godwin. Amen. The pastor let me portrays of what we've been talking about ever since. Let me, let me make a, a valid point here. Whether the church celebrates Valentine's Day or not, it is being celebrated by your, by your prayer band leader. And the earlier you think of a way of keeping the youth in track, the better for the church. God bless you, Brother Godwin. Thank you, Pastor. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you. Actually, the queen wants to see you. But I don't want to call you on phone because I need to discuss with you first. Ale, the queen wants to see me. That, 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 that means there's good news for me then. Well, if you will call it so. Uh, uh, ne, um, I, I hope it is not to come and be one of those body, bodyguards in the palace. So. On the contrary, the queen wants you to become the princess's personal driver. Ne. What was the other one now? Huh? Who wants to be a driver, Kwan? I know you don't drive, but she says that you'll be trained. And then they'll get you all, all the necessary driving papers. No, I'm not interested. Kwan, ah, you cannot reject the Queen's request. You cannot. Says who? Because it is our custom and our tradition. You cannot, you cannot refuse it. And listen to me. You have to start that work. You're, you're a man. You're not getting younger. And one biko. You know go. No, you know all that. But driving is not my calling. Uh, just start from there. You never can tell. You might, you might just meet somebody there in the palace that will get you a better job out there. I mean, all that young men will jump at this opportunity. What is wrong with you? Hey, go to anyone. There is nothing like a humble beginning. Start from this, start from, from this first. Something better will definitely come up. Oh? Anyway, just, just think about it. Think about it. to know, speak. Your Majesty, we the cabinet members of Kaneku Council of Elders are here to see you on a, a very serious matter that is affecting the progress of this land. All right. I am aware that uh, the request for this meeting is a very unusual one because I know our next council meeting is supposed to be in three weeks' time. So what is this serious matter about? Your Majesty, you are right. Um, we are sorry to bother you, actually. But um, it, it, it is about your son, the heir apparent to this show. My son? Yes, Your Majesty. What about him? Your Majesty, we demand that the prince be cautioned about the kind of life he's living. Yes, Your Majesty. Your son, the crown prince of this great kingdom, is misleading our youths. 
It has become a tale of concern, and uh, some of us are seriously affected. Uh, uh, my king, just last night, my son came back stupidly drunk. For an outing he went with his prince. Your Majesty, the news in town is about how the prince declares free alcoholic drinking spree and a cigarette to young boys of this kingdom. Yeah. In every beer parlor he goes to. Well, uh, maybe he was being generous to... to... Generous, you said. That is generosity in a wrong way. If the prince wants to be generous to the people of uh, our kingdom, he should open businesses for them, not to not the generosity of giving them drinks. Or you will help them with a trade. Uh, huh? Look, look, let me tell you. If you want the king or the prince to do something for your children, eh? why don't you come out openly and say it? Then read Maroli. Obwefi, you are sitting there. I think you are just. Obwefi, in Nigeria, what are they saying? Who? Inside your government, who are you talking to? Obwefi, you are sitting. Eh? Am I going to hear that? Do you, do you, do you know who you are talking to? Why should you talk to us like that? Obwefi, you are just showing. I am saying you are just showing. Obwefi, 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 if you don't know how to address elders, please keep quiet. You are telling me to shut up. You are telling me to shut up. No, I can't shut up. Uh, my king, this is not a meeting at all. It is not. This is just like them summoning you, the king, to answer their query. For the kind gesture of your son. That is what it means. Kind <laughs> gesture. Huh? Misleading the use of this lad. That's exactly what you call kind gesture. Mm -hmm. Is this how you are fathering your children? <laughs> yes. also, also, Ibo, fathering your children. What do you understand by fathering children? What do you understand by that? Eh? Yes, I know how to father my children. To teach them when to start and when to stop. But look at you, you. You don't know how to teach your children moral ethics. You have to follow your sons, but don't miss them. Don't let them. Oh, boy, it's just sure, no. You are leading them to God. I said, shut up. Give me a rejection. No. Give me a rejection. No. I will not. Enough, I will not shut enough, up. Enough. Enough. Sorry, my king. My king, I'm sorry. Uh -uh. Um, is this why this meeting was called? Yes, sir, yes, yes, my dear. All right. I want to apologize on behalf of my son. All right? I will speak to him and caution him. My king, let them also caution their children. Let them caution their children. Because I know that the prince did not force the drink down their throats. Yes, or did they? Did he? I'm asking you, no. Did the prince force the drink into the throat of your son? Eh? You clearly have that's, no use for That's this. enough. That's enough. That's enough. I will speak to my son. All right? Yes, my king. You will leave love, my king. <laughs> Please sit down. Thank you, my king. Uh, hey. You're welcome. Thank you, my king. You can leave. Hmm. Yeah. My king. Yes. Um. When I left the palace yesterday, something struck my mind. And I decided to come here today and discuss it with you. All right. 
What is it that struck your mind? I think I know a better way to curb Prince Chidi's lascivious uh, lifestyle. All right, I'm all ears. <laughs> what he needs now is a woman in his life. Oh, boy, Fee. <laughs> Prince Chidi has not had just a woman, but he has had several women. And if that was capable of changing, you would have. You would have settled down to one woman by now. Um, I am not talking about a girlfriend or this pick and drop. Or these drunks and prostitutes that follow him about. No. I am talking about a real woman. A well-cultured girl that will help him cope his uh, 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 bad behavior. That is what I am talking about. Obuefi, it is difficult to find such well-cultured girls these days. And even the so-called good ones are all hypocrites. <sighs> there are still good ones, so Yes, and I know about one. And who is this unique girl? Where is she from? <laughs> it's Ezinda, my first daughter. You know her too well. Ezinda. Yes, my king. The one that used to help your late wife in our cricket business? You know her very well. You see, Ezine has become a full-grown woman. Well-cultured. Very industrious. In fact, Ezine will make a great queen in Kaneku Kingdom. <laughs> I remember you once mentioned to me that she carried on her late mother's Okrika business. Yes. Yes, she carried it on and she has been doing it very well for herself. Ah, as in a, is a, a, it's an asset. All right. <laughs> I, I hope this works. Ah, it will work. <laughs> it will work, my king. <laughs> as in a, has never disappointed me. It will work. All right. I will discuss <laughs> this with my wife, the queen, and um, we will probably invite her over to dinner. Okay. Okay. Thank you, my king. I will be very, very grateful to you. I mean, if this works, because I mean, you don't know the calamity you'll be saving me from if it works out. Like I said, it will work out. Ezin has always made me proud. All right. It will. All right. Chief Gera, I've been looking for you. Any problem? Yes, there's a problem. I don't like it to sound like I'm complaining. I don't like complaining. But I'm not a man who stays in, a, in one place at a time. So what do you want? See, I want to go to the studio. Yes, I need to, my studio time is, is almost around the corner. Let me go to the studio and before evening, I am back. Young man. I will advise you don't step out because the king will discipline you if he finds out you are not in the palace. Chief Gada was employed here to be the princess's driver. But she doesn't go anywhere. She doesn't seem to. What type of what kind of job is this now? The princess only goes out on her appointment today with her physiotherapist. Does she have, does she have an appointment today? No, I wouldn't know. Grace is the only one that can tell me. Because she's a personal maid. Where can I find Grace? She, she should be the one. I, I, in fact, I should be talking to Grace now, not you. Grace does not use this as a the because she's a personal maid. I don't like this kind of job. Bro. I don't like this kind of. Bro. This, this is not what I plan for. But what, what is this? Why are you even grumbling? You are still going to be paid. So why disturb yourself? And so, paid with well, well, stupid payment. How much is even the money? I will help you. During lunch, the king and the queen will be downstairs. I will come and take you to Princess Injite Castle. Ha! Listen to me. You have to be very careful, very, very careful. Because if you are caught, I will deny you completely. 
<laughs> Don't worry about that. I will, mm. I will be caught. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Just be complaining. You did work. Now you're employed. You didn't start your place. <laughs> Michael Jackson. I am in it. I am in it. That's your license and your permits. <laughs> Seriously. Congratulations, my brother. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I appreciate it. You're welcome. So, how far? My brother, nothing much. It's just that <laughs> I... All I do here is sit, sleep, eat, and shit. <laughs> well, look at you. No wonder you're you know, growing those big. See your cheeks now. Mama, see your skin. <laughs> Come on, move, please. This is not what I planned out for myself. I sincerely don't know what I'm doing here. <sighs> don't tell me you're whining me like a woman. Or are you avoiding to be envied? Envied of what? Envied of cruising around town with a princess. Well, my brother, you wouldn't believe that ever since I started working here. I am yet to set my eyes on the princess. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, yes. 100% serious. I mean, um, to find time to come for studio recording. I mean, studio sessions. No, wait, oh, it's been one month. Oh. And you've not seen the princess? Not at all. You see, the chief guy promised to take me to, you know, promised to take me to our room, but on the said day, he said he was busy. And you won't believe that. The princess has refused to go see her therapist ever since I started working here. Which is why I wonder what I am doing here. My oh, brother, they need to let me go. Uh, well, um, you see, Godwin, that's not an issue. Since you will be paid at the end of the month, I mean, whether you walk or not, I suggest you will fix your studio hours at night. Well, if you will do that for me, why not? <laughs> so, my man, <laughs> anything for you now, yeah, provided you help me get the princess. Why not? <laughs> oh, that's not much of a problem. <laughs> I believe we can work something out. Sure. Yeah. And you see, um, whenever you're driving with the princess, as soon as you get close, just give me a call. <laughs> it's all good, my brother. Uh, give me a call. You know, I'll show with the speed of light. I sure will. <laughs> All right, yeah. now. Yeah, you take care, man. Okay, now. Um, I won't you walk your guy? <laughs> walk your guy now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for the queen. Godwin. Mm. This is a palace. You don't come in here without an invitation. Mm. Calm down. Bring, 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 calm down. Let's stop shouting. Do you know the gravity of the offense that you have committed? Do you know? Uh, eh? Yes. Co coming here is an offense. But I walk here now. People don't walk around here anyhow. That is why you never see the girls standing around endlessly. Please start going before anyone sees you, please. I came to give the, the queen my particulars now. Hey, you'd have told the guards, or better still, the queen's maids, so that they would take the message to the queen. You don't need to come in here. It's so bad, there are no problems in there. I, I, I... Please, please go. I'll go. Go and make sure nobody sees you. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. bye, -bye.
Promise. Your Highness. I have a plan I want to execute. I've been stuck in between for a very long time. But one thing told me that you'll be the one to execute it for me. I'm at your service, Your Highness. So that point, buddy, what do you know about him? I don't really know much about him, my queen. But if I'll be given time, I can get all the necessary information you need. There's no time. Just a little time you have trying to turn this palace, won't you? What can you speak about it? Well, my queen, he's calm-headed, a perfect gentleman with a lot of aspiration. Good. I want him to marry my daughter, the princess. What do you think about that? That would be nice, my queen, if he will accept that. Because that young man doesn't look like he will accept such. He seems to want much more out of life, my queen. What gave you that impression? Just this afternoon, he complained of being idle. That's interesting. He said he's not happy with the fact that he's here without any evidence to work. Even when I showed him of his salary, my queen, he was still complaining that he needs a more physical work. Wow. But my queen, why him? Family, as much as they're not of uh, middle class. You're right, my queen. I need him to get closer to the princess. I need both of them to be seeing each other more. All right, your highness. Thank you. Thank you, your highness. Thank God you're back, Daddy. Yes. Hey. Well, today, what is the excitement all about? Um, Daddy, I brought back some clothes from the shop so that I can wear to the palace for a dinner with the royal household. Um, Daddy, which one of this should I wear? Daddy, should, should I try it so that you can uh, no, see no, how they fit no, on no, me? No, 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 this one is perfectly okay. Uh, this yes. one. This one. Mm. 
Do you know I actually put this one first? Okay. Okay. Let me hurry go in, wash it and iron it before evening. I hope you Yes, I did. I made the love rice. Okay, daddy. Okay, let me get you your food. Thank you so much. Thank you. May the gods keep you. Thank you. Please calm down. Let us hear from him. It may be my accusation. What was he doing there? Does that place look like his mother's kitchen? Your Majesty, actually, he deserves to be beheaded, but let us stand by justice with mercy. If only for this poor uh, my king, I don't think it would be fair to deny him a fair hearing. Yes, I agree with what Chief Mazin said. Let's hear from him. All right. Speak. May you live long, my king. My others, I greet you. It is true that the chief guard caught me in a compromising position with the princess. But I am innocent of the accusation to have defiled her. Are you sure you are innocent? Because the princess will be examined and will be dealt with if the examination proves to be positive. My elder, I am speaking nothing but the truth. The princess can testify to this. The testimony of the princess cannot be trusted. What? Because of her condition, she might give a random uh, uh, testimony. Two, she was said to be unconscious when the offense was committed. Yes. I have already invited the doctor to come and confirm this. In the meanwhile, taken back to the guard room, I'll make my decision known in the morning. You will be ready. Please help me beg the king. I don't want anything bad to happen to my son. I won't survive it. I'll just die. Please. Esther. Yes, my queen. I told you that the king mentioned it. And he said he would let your son go. Okay, just because of you. Nothing bad will happen to him, so you need to go home. My queen, how can I go home? My fate will not carry me home, knowing that my son, my only son, is in trouble with the whole kingdom. Please. Please, I beg of like you. Like I said, he said he will let him go. It's best you go home and come back tomorrow morning. I will speak to him this night. Okay. Okay, my queen. Please do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my queen.
Held us in council. This is my judgment. For the offense of defiling the princess. Godwin will marry her. Godwin will marry the princess for defiling her. This is based on the report of the doctor in respect of the events that happened last night. I have taken this decision in consideration of the fact that he is a son of the soil. Otherwise, the consequences might have been more grievous. That is my judgment. It's okay. It's not as if it's a life sentence. At least it's still better than handing you over to the police or sending you off to an exile. Eh? No. Sincerely, I would prefer to be in the police net than to marry an imbecile. Oh, yes. Godwin, do you want to kill me? Godwin, do you do you want do you want to dig my grave before my time? Eh? Why don't you just get married to the princess and let sanity and peace reign? Please. Do you want to go to jail? No, tell me, do you want to go to jail? Let you know. I'm beginning to look at you somehow. Are you for me or against me? And I'm your only son for crying out loud. No. The way you paid? How dare you talk down on me? Are you, I, I, in our parlor, are you mad? Eh? I warned you when you were sneaking around the palace. I warned you of his consequences. Not knowing that, that you went into the princess's room. Now look at what you've brought upon yourself. You're so stubborn. Just like your father. This was the same act of stubbornness that led to your father's early death. Yes! I thought you said my father was killed by assassins. Your father never listened to me. He refused to listen to the voice of reasoning when I warned him not to go to that meeting that he got him killed. Now you are exactly like your father, very stubborn. Why can't you listen to your mother, my son? Why can't you? Why can't you? Do you want to, to fight King Okago? You cannot win the fight. You cannot. They're just like my father, a lion cannot be get a goat. Yes, my father was a lion and I'm a lion. Yes, but I stand where I am still standing. Nay, I would prefer to go to jail than to marry any person. And I am telling you to get married to the princess and save yourself. Save yourself from further consequences. You have to listen to me, I'm your mother. I cannot mislead you. Mm -hmm. I don't talk about this again. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be wise. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. can't find him or his mother. No, we have not seen Godwin. We heard that he left with the mother for, for the princess marriage. Okay. He now lives in the palace, right? 
No, we heard that the king gave him one of his mansions. Are you serious? Oh, there's no problem no no no, <laughs> no problem don't worry I'll, I'll try to reach you okay sir all right all right thank you very much He found out that the children have eaten all the food. <laughs> so the man was like, oh, who will I eat? Who will I eat? Oh, I pity for the man. <laughs> good morning, my prince. Yeah, good morning. How are you? I'm fine, my prince. And how is Oh, how's my beautiful sister doing? What is it? Go away. Uh, it's okay. You don't want to talk to me. Okay, I'm sorry. Right? No. Please, I am sick. Okay, the truth is that eh, I have been very, very busy. No. Gee, I am sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, I'll make it up to you. Uh, my prince, is the marriage still holding this evening? Oh, yes. Uh, has the queen not come to tell her? No, my prince. Oh, dear. It's Getting married. Yes, Angie is getting married. Mm -hmm. So, um, Angie, um, when he came yesterday, uh, what happened? Nothing. Nothing? Angie, he did not touch you. Mm -hmm. Are you sure he did not touch you? I, I, I touched him. Mm. Past him, I told him to sit down and then I held him so that he will not run away like he to do. Kinky is getting married. The queen told me. <laughs> The queen told you. The yeah. queen told me. Damn. The queen told you since. My princess. Look at this. Look at this picture. Do you see this one? Yes. Do you like him? Yes. His name is Godwin. Okay. I want him to be your husband. Do you know what husband is? Husband and wife. Yes. In one room yes. together forever. Yes. <laughs> My princess. <laughs> okay. So, you guys are going to be married forever. Mother, marry Godwin. Yes, you will marry Godwin. Mm -hmm. And you guys will live forever. <laughs> Mother, don't deceive me. You deceive me at God. My princess, I can never deceive you. No mommy loves you. Uh -huh. hmm? <laughs> Don't worry. Uh -huh. <laughs> Jay, it's okay. I have to leave now. It's bringing hmm? so much I'll be back. And <laughs> no, I promise you. Please remind me of your sister. I promise I'll come and see you, okay? The effort some people put into planning and plotting of this evil is so appalling. All for selfish needs, powered by greed. Oh, in the process, 
the innocence of a man. These people, they don't really care as long as they get what they are after. This is sad. Oh, this is so bad. Sometimes things are not always as they seem. Why are you sulking? Isn't this what you wanted? Only this man. This man. Okay, so how did you plan it? Why are you even asking like you care? Yeah. Look, that boy is very daring. He will flee at the slightest opportunity he gets and make a mockery of my judgment. Okay, I don't understand. But we can just keep him here to your own watch, but why slowly planning the wedding of my daughter? So she can have a befitting wedding. The wedding of like stock of the town, wedding of the crowd of like Rwanda. Oh, I see. That's your problem. Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, dear wife. I will not give that boy a chance to ridicule me all in the name of planning a talk of the town marriage. I won't. How about the elders? The elders are you going to leave them out to I have already sent notice to them. Anyone who wants to come will come, regardless of the short notice. So you're just going to marry my daughter? Your daughter, the only daughter we have. Both like that, like no. Come on. It's very common at you. Enough, enough. I'm already doing your bidding. Unless you want me to cancel everything. No. Just I just just want to feel good. For my friends and my wishes. For them to know that my daughter, my only daughter is getting married. And you know, for me to feel good. That's what I'm asking for. Okay. My only daughter, just one. Ayelele, ayelele, mama le, mama le 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 le. How could you, Godwin? I didn't know you are this wicked. The heart of man that says truly wicked. What is wrong with you, dude? What is wrong with you? <sighs> Got it. So, I told you how I wanted the princess. And then you went behind me, you fast forwarded your footstep just to snatch her away from me, right? I told you I didn't do it. Why can't you believe me? Why are you finding it so hard, so difficult, so, so hard to believe me? Why? Why would I believe you, Gordon? No, tell me, why would I believe you? So even if you want me to believe you, will it help me? Now listen, Gordon. If truly you are innocent, why didn't you call me when you were with the, the princess? So at least I can hear her sweet voice. There was no time for that. There was no time. Do you have time for that? You didn't have time. How would you have time when you had your own plans? Yes. I told you I want the princess. When I was even talking, you were looking at me like a fool. You're a fool. God, me, a fool? A big fool. No, sincerely, you actually think I will abandon all my dreams? To be with an incapacitated princess? You really <laughs> Godwin, you're calling me a fool, Abby. Godwin, listen, listen. If not because we're in the palace, eh? I would have beaten you blue black. Trust me. Do not let this your muscles deceive you, okay? Don't let them deceive you. I go humble you. Sincerely. You go humble me. Oh yeah, now come now. Let's go and do training. Come! Come, where are you go? Go. come now if you're not afraid. No, do training in front of the, the, the house, Abby. Where are you going to? Let's go and do one. Let's go to the backyard. Don't you know where they fight? Go digger. Come on, get lost. Go, you're walking out of me, Godwin. You're walking out of me. No, Allah, now. We'll do training. Check out in this village together now. I'll track you. Nonsense. Hey! 
My son has been forced to marry against his will. I don't know how this happened. But if at the end of the day, my son gets married as the king has declared it, then I know that your hand is in it. Because it will not allow any temptation that is beyond us to come to us. That is why you are God. That is why you are the king of kings. Lord, you have the final say. Let your will be done. My princess, <laughs> isn't she beautiful? It's my wife. I'll take very good care of her, trust me. Thank you so much. You're doing a good job already. And she'll give us a beautiful baby. <laughs> Judging mm -hmm. <laughs> your attitude towards getting married to my sister, well, the king wanted you to remain in the palace so he could monitor how you take care of my sister. But I suggested to him to get you a house so you could start up your own family and then. Uh, build your own family and I also suggested to him that he should get you a car you know one parked outside so you could um, move around town so <clears throat> Gordon told me was there a woman in your life before my sister I had more important things to do with my life and my time than to get myself involved with some relationships with women. That's good. And I don't want to hear someday that um, you know, something happened to my sister while in bed. Or uh, maybe you're saying it's an accident or something. I wouldn't want to hear anything like that. If there's anyone I'd love to kill, that will be that idiot's promise. Mm -hmm. And whoever that paid him to do this to me. No, you won't say that. Every evidence, everything proved that you. Uh, very clean, you know. But that would not that is that that has passed. Uh, what has happened has happened. So you just have to move on with your life. Okay? Just just move on and forget about that. It's um I mean no disrespect. But I'll have to look after me. My princess. You look so beautiful. Mm. I, I. It's okay. I'll let you be. But I want you to hear this. If anything, even an aunt, but my sister, you got me. You. I would burn you alive while screaming. And your mother, I will make her a slave in the royal house. 
I'll see you have death. <laughs> Here. I asked the question. What is she doing here? Sir, it is a first night as couple. So I, I thought I should bring her to your room so that you guys can spend the night together. Now you take her back to her room. There's no such thing as couple night here. Sir? Are you there for something? I'm sorry. So take her back to her room. You told me you wanted to show me something at the palace. And this is my room. And uh, it is in the palace. So definitely if I want to show you something, it has to be in my room. <laughs> You're so cunning. Thank you. Yeah, you sound sensitive too. Yeah. No, it's not yet time for that. Huh? I mean, why are you behaving like a child that was still going to get married and definitely will be doing this? And so, what's the big deal? Of course, we're going to get married, but that's why we have to wait. I mean, we, we have forever together, so why the rush? You start irritating me when you start what is your lousy summons. Um, please, my friends, I'm not that kind of a girl. That is why I want you. Huh? That is why I fell for you. So, so, so don't start then behaving this, this, this irritating kind of behavior from a local village, primitive. I'm going to take it easy, right? Come on. Oh, Malicham. Stop crying, oh? You know, go. Your husband will send for you when he's ready for you. And uh, you will be in your husband's room. After all, you're his wife. But ma, why did Mr. Godwin send the princess out of his room? Um, that one is by the way. It's not fair. He will send for her when he wants her. He's her husband. A princess. Hmm? I'm a chicken now. It's not fair at all. Just give him a little more time. He'll be ready for you. Oh? My son's wife. I'm Malicham. We are God win. <laughs> Don't worry. Your husband will surely send for you. Oh? You go and meet him in his room. Now come, let, let me take you to your room. Hmm? And let's let's take her to your room. Thank you. 
Mamale, mamale, le, 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 le. You know, I taught you a different from every other girl. I was looking forward to have something, you know, some special moment, something very spectacular with you. And not knowing you as deep as a little girl, I have had something to do with you. I'm sorry, my prince, if you feel disappointed in me. So this is what I would have found out on the night of our wedding, that you're a broken plot. <sighs> But my prince, you never asked. Because I was told that you were different. And when I saw you, I thought so too. And I was thinking that place would have been the same too. My prince, thank you. She hurt me with those words. You did not only hurt me. You broke me into pieces. And let me announce this to you. That this whole thing, this whole thing is over. I am sorry, my friends. I am truly sorry. Get dressed and leave my room. I don't want to ever see you here again. Never. Please, my friends, so do this to me. Please. What would I tell my father? Go home and tell your father how deep you are down there. Oh, good morning, Bob. The night was good, I guess. I slept fine. Why, is it, why are you in the kitchen? Oh, I am trying to tidy up the kitchen then. I need breakfast. And where is the princess? Where is who? The princess, for crying out loud, Mom. You know, if I don't do it, if I don't do it, nobody will do it. Of course someone will do it. There is a wife in this house. As the man on this house, I will not tolerate it. Grace, where is the princess? Still in bed, sir. Still in what? By this time of the day? I'm sorry, sir. She usually wakes up by 10 a.m. In her father's house. She wakes up by 10 a.m. in her father's house. Not in my house! So she thinks she's in the father's house where everything is being done for her. Like I came in, coming to America. Now you get up there and wake her ass up. Well, sir, what do you want her to do for you? I can do it. I mean, that is why I'm here. You must be very stupid. You, you must be very stupid, idiot. Where, where, where is she? Where? My friend, will you? Come on, will you get up? Get up! Where do you think this place is? Your father's house? Where everything is being done for you? Don't you give me that room? Hmm? What do you mean by room? Hmm? Huh? You're my, 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 my wife, right? Good. Now you get your ass up from this bed and go into the kitchen to make breakfast for your husband. Good. I give you two seconds.
What's up, son? I just want to make a small trip. Where are you headed? Out to the States. Just for some 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 fresh air. To the States? Just like that. <laughs> you didn't even tell us, or does your mother know about this? Dad, I am an adult now. <laughs> All right. Does this have anything to do with the princess being married to that boy? No, no. It doesn't. Uh, this is strictly personal. And what about your fiance? Does she know about this? Or is she traveling with you? She's not traveling with me, but she's aware of it. Okay. I'll see you out of there tomorrow. All right, take care of yourself. Have a safe trip. Chako, what's going on? Yeah, why are you not in the studio? Oh, okay, okay, yeah, I remember. No, I've not really had time to listen to it. Wow, this is nice. Amadu, <laughs> I, I like the chorus. Kojo, 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 kojo. Angele, angele, angele. Amadu, kojo, kojo, kojo. Angele, 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 angele. Kojo. Le, please. Le, please, stay away from my marital issues. Okay, for. Godwin, I know that you're not happy with the whole situation. But if the king gets to know about this, he will not spare you. And you know it. You have to take things easy. But the king will not cough. Oh, yes, he will not cough. Didn't he know that his daughter is disabled? before he forcefully married her out. My son, I know you are not happy with this whole situation, but you know how it is. You know how it came about all this. You have to take things easy. Don't make the princess suffer for all this because she's innocent. No, she's not innocent or anything. Yes, she's not innocent at all. In fact, they, see, we have gone past that stage. Yes, we are married now. So let her marry the marry. The princess has never, ever done anything by herself since she was born. Mm -hmm. So if you want her to start doing things around the house, she has to learn. We will have to teach her. Be patient with her, Mwami Nugo. Be patient. No. Your blood is too hot. Mm -hmm. People who jump into the ocean without proper swimming abilities must learn how to swim in the middle of the ocean or get drowned. Or better still, they'll be thrown out by the waves. And what kind of stupid parable is that? Le, even the king knows that any woman, in fact, every woman who wants to settle down, who wants to get married, must learn, they must be equipped on how to take care of her home. Since the king forcefully married out her, his, his daughter, she has to learn it here. But one thing I would not take away is have my mother serve my wife. Oh, my man. But I am not complaining, I am, am I? I am complaining. Eh? Let's keep managing her. Mama, 
le 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 le. Stop this now. What kind of an evil act is that? Let that be it. Stop it. They tell her to keep her heart steady. What is the meaning of this? What is her now? Let her be it. Let me take her to the pharmacy so that they will give her proper treatment. There is nothing to first aid here. This is a domestic accident. Oh, the blood will stop. It is it's only a court to me. Uh -huh. Careful. Don't Don't you believe in me? I've not slept with any other man but you. When you have not shown anything to prove that you are still a virgin. <laughs> I don't know why. But that's the truth. A big liar. And it's even more irritating when you try to cook stories. You never loved me. I thought we were going to be different. That's why I gave you my body. But no. You wanted to mess me up. It's not your fault. Take the blame. I take the blame for being so cheap. I know you're tired. You can go ahead and victimize yourself for all I care. I mean, I could get sex if I needed sex, I could have gotten it anyway. And even more better than you give me. Lies. Sex is all you wanted from me. And you're happy I made your list. I hope you are very happy right now. I'm a prince. I cannot stoop so low. All because of sex, no, I can't do that. And you, you were supposed to be special, right? Huh? You were wicked, man. Uh, you're the 50th person saying it this week. Is in You're here. Good morning. Morning. How was your night? Fine, and yours. Oh, my night was splendid. Hey. <laughs> Very splendid. In fact, I had the best night ever in my life. Oh, really? You have to tell me about it. Okay. Let me get this. I will. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so, yes, I said me. I had the best.
best night ever in my life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was in my dream last night. Mm -hmm. And I saw myself in your wedding. Dancing and dancing and dancing. Different types of lyrics. Eh? Different musicians playing. And different dance steps I, I was able to put up. <laughs> and people were spraying money on me. In <laughs> my dream. <laughs> <laughs> and then a wedding with who? Uh, who else? Who else if not the prince? Eh? No, daddy. Um, I'm sorry to tell you that I'm no longer interested in marrying the prince. <laughs> Is that a kind of joke or what? Uh, Is that a kind of joke? <laughs> No, Daddy, I'm very serious. I find out some things about the prince that I don't like. No, 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 no. It, it is always like that. See, in a relationship, you will find some things that you will not like about your, your, your man. And he will also find out some things he will not like about you. But that is the essence of courtship. You now come together Fine tune those things and now become one indivisible family. Just like a broom that nobody can break. And so when you come together, nobody can push you aside, nobody can break you. That is how it is. You, you cannot, because of that, say you, you cut off the, the marriage. No, it is not like that. Huh? Daddy, I'm sorry, I, I can't continue with the marriage with the prince. I can't. <sighs> can continue the marriage. <laughs> what really happened? What really happened? Um, who goes about spreading news of bad eggs? I love that. So you know you're a bad egg. Well, <clears throat> I'll be leaving for the States very soon. And I've done everything. I've tried to tell them everything. Um, told them all the stories that I could tell them, but they still will not believe me. I want you, you know, to act as if the idea is all yours, that you don't want us to get married. Simple. And what would I say if they ask me a reason? Something. Just tell them you 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 you, you barged into me and I was taking hard jobs, so you tried to, you know, stop me. I, I held you and I tried to strangle you to death. You know, that would scare, actually scare your, your family. And everyone would just believe the story. Yeah. Everyone will believe me. God. Do you know that I can actually claim that you raped me and she'll be forced to get married to me just like God Queen and the Princess. Will you just stop mocking me? You see, let me tell you. <clears throat> I couldn't have been able to cope with you as a wife, you know? Yeah, because you're not as sweet as I thought um, when I saw you. I thought you were going to be sweet. And you a royalty, little of royalty, um, touches your life. The real you will show, you know? That, that stubborn, local, primitive girl who will just puff. Sure, now I am a prince. 
I need a submissive woman for a wife. Not a local like you. Something. Just tell them you 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 you, you barged into me and I was taking head jokes. So you tried to, you know, stop me. Uh, I I held you and I tried to strangle you to death. You know that would scare actually scare your your family, and everyone would just believe this story. Yeah. Everyone will believe me. God. Do you know that I can actually claim that you raped me and she'll be forced to get married to me just like God Queen and the Princess? Will you just stop mocking me? <clears throat> I couldn't have been able to cope with you as a wife, you know? Yeah, because you're not as sweet as I thought um, when I saw you. I thought you were going to be sweet. And you, a royalty, little of royalty, um, touches your life. The real you will show, you know? That, that stubborn, local, Primitive girl who oh, will just puff. Sure, now I am a prince. I need a submissive woman for a wife. Not a local like you. Those were his words to me. I'm, I'm sorry I failed you. You mean he really said those words to you? Yes, Daddy. We got into an argument and he became irritated and angry that I, I was talking back at him and I too was angry. And he was talking down on me. So I, I angrily told him that it's over because he was talking down on me because I was not royalty. Hi! Is in there? Is in there? Don't you know you are not supposed to, to argue with a man? Eh? Of a man that is planning to keep you under his roof. Jay, what kind of thing is this? My enemies are at work again. Daddy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I failed you again. I'm sorry. Are you off to? But it's now, of course. It was a stressful day yesterday. My whole body hurts. There's a spa, of course. Blah, 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 blah. I mean on that. I think something is wrong with you. The sooner you tame that spirit that keeps distracting you from your responsibilities in this palace, the better for all of us. You should stop talking to me like that. Before you made me queen, before you made me your queen, I was already a princess. Not a commoner that you met on the streets. You can't talk to me anyhow. I am royalty for crying out loud. <laughs> royalty, royalty, royalty. That's all I hear in this house. Royalty. What is that? It has blinded you to reality. What reality are you talking about? What reality? 
Look, how about meeting the expectations of your people? How about leaving the responsibilities of this same royalty you're talking about? It's time for you to start impacting lives. Impacting lives? Yes. I don't like this. When I came up with my NGO, I tried to help the less privileges. They do charity, but you kept talking down on me until it was shut down. Now you're talking about impacting lives. What lives are you talking about? Look, your so-called NGO, your so-called charity was nothing but a show-off. Yes, you were in competition with other elites who are making the same mistakes you're making. Oh, tell me more, my king. Look, if you want to do a charity, if you really want that your NGO to make a meaning, change the lives of these people. What am I supposed to do? Don't just give them food and drinks and beverages that will finish the next day and they will find this, the, the, themselves in the same situation they were before. What in the world am I supposed to do for them? Die for them like some kind of savior? Is that what you want? Give them a life. Teach them how to fish. Create job opportunities for them. That's what will change their lives. Not giving them food and drinks and beverages that they will eat and still be in the same situation you found them in. Anyway, I really have to go. Go ahead. Go to your spa. Yes, Grace, what is the meaning of this? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. She said she wants to come and join you to watch the TV. With who? With you, sir. Are you, are you, are you out of here? With, with who? Which TV? Huh? My friend, will you take back, take, take, take this, this thing out of my sight? Is this how she, you, you, you watch TV in your father's palace? You are very, very mean. Is your father, your father, the king, sitting on that throne that is mean? Oh, who will kill you? How will you even watch the TV? How will your head still watch the TV? What are you doing? Let me, don't enjoy yourself, fool. Oh. Watch the TV, let me go upstairs. How will you watch the TV with your head like a gamma lizard? What kind of a man is this? Oh, thanks, my sister. Please just sit. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. just woke up this morning and went on an emergency journey without any motive. Hey. Uh, hey. My king, are you trying to tell me that the prince is not in town? No. He said he was going on a short trip to the States. Hey! Jay! I noticed something strange about his mood this morning when he was leaving. But I didn't know it was connected to his inner in any way. And by the way, he told me she was aware of the trip. Eh? He said she was aware of his trip. Isn't he is aware of the trip? Isn't he? And she didn't tell me. I would have rushed down immediately. And 
Maybe we would have stopped him from traveling. It's all right. It's all right. Um, it's all right. We'll work it out. Since they are in love with each other, it will be easy to mediate. All right? Uh, okay, my king. Uh, you see, I have scolded my daughter very well. And I promise you, I will make her to apologize to the prince once it, he is back. Obwefi, it's all right. Hmm? It's all right. These things happen. <sighs> Did you see how great they looked together? <laughs> <laughs> you see, uh, looking at them, reminded me of my youthful days with my late wife. In fact, I was looking forward for that great day to come by. Don't worry about it. Everything will be worked out. I think he took this trip to clear his head, and by the time he returns, he'll be over it, and he'll even be in a better frame of mind to talk to. <laughs> Thank you, my king. You're welcome. Thank you. Well, lest I forget, have you heard from uh, our newly married princess? How are they? I haven't heard from them, but I, I, I wanted to leave them alone so that they can bond before seeing them again, you know? Okay. Yes. They need that space. Yeah, because checking on them regularly will make them to be dependent. That's it. That's <laughs> it. That's it. That's it. I've given them everything they need. <laughs> mm. I know you. I know my king. I know what you can do. Yes. <laughs> Are you not Okago eh? or Bamba the sixth of uh, Kanebu? <laughs> we chose you. We know you before we chose you. We know what you can do. <laughs> we know you, my Thank king. You, Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. We know you. <laughs> I know. <laughs> uh, uh, how did you request that I meet you here? <sighs> I'm just coming from the king's uh, palace. In fact, uh, you, should, you should have come straight to my house instead of uh, calling me out here as if uh, I am your secret lover. Oh, no. Oh, no. Stop whining like a woman. We have a serious matter to discuss here. What happened? Ayelele, ayelele. Mama le, mama le, 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 le. Aziness marriage plan with Prince Chidi. It's about hitting the rocks. It's about hitting the rocks. That is why I called you so that we can discuss and have a plan B. I, I, I thought everything was moving on smoothly. Um, I don't want to discuss what the problem is. Ezine is just the problem. Yes. Ezine is the, at fault. What happened? <laughs> In fact, they got to a heated argument. And uh, Ezine displayed some kind of stubbornness. So the prince felt that instead of Ezine being stubborn, that she should be submissive. Mm -hmm. Yes. And uh, because of that, the argument continued and continued. And then Ezine got annoyed and called off the, the engagement. Hi. Hi. Yes, of nowadays. She should have been more patient and tolerant. You see why I told you you should let her know about our plans? Because if she had known the reason behind mm. uh, our request to, for her to marry the prince, huh? she should have been more tolerant and mm. corporate. It wouldn't have worked out. My daughter is too uh, immoral for that kind of secret. Do you know that? What of them very well? Yes, you know? we all know that. Uh -huh. So what do you think would have happened when they are engrossed in love? Don't you think my daughter would have let out the cat on the bag? Then your case should have been as good as mine. So what do we do now? Yes, I am, my queen. Uh, that's just a side hustle. Yeah, this is my main profession. I'm a sound engineer. Wow. So Godwin is your friend? Yes. He's my very good friend. It's just that I was not in town to attend this marriage ceremony. You do know about his musical career, right? Yeah, sure. Um, 
This is Dean Sound Studio. So this is where we record all Godwin's music. Um, let me quickly play one of the lyrics for you. I'm sure you'll like it. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's Godwin? Yeah, Godwin. <laughs> I'm glad I'm in the right place. <laughs> yeah, uh, at your service, my queen. I would like you to give me an estimate of what it's going to cost to produce a song. Um, okay. Uh, we actually stopped recording for some time because of money. No, money shouldn't be the problem. Like I said, I'll take care of all the financial problems. Oh, thank you so much, my queen. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, just follow me to the car, right? I'll give you a check. Wow. Okay, my queen. Thank you so much. Thank you. My princess, it's okay. Stop crying, please. He likes NG. Just that he wants you to do things by yourself. That is all. Teach me. I will learn. Okay. I will teach you, my princess. I will. But it's a gradual process. I'm going to do everything. I will teach you. I promise. I will teach you. But you can't learn everything in one day. It's a gradual process. Okay? Please stop crying. Stop crying. It's okay. How splendid. Your son left this palace. I mean this country since three days ago and you're just you're just noticing his absence? What a shining example of a mother. Don't give me this thing to your father. I'm not doing anything to you. You're doing it to yourself. Oh. What happened? Did he say anything? Did you see him before he left? What actually happened? Why would he leave without telling me? I don't know. I just, uh, I just saw him that morning when I was having a walk around the palace premises. Did he say anything to you? Anything happened? I can't tell, but I was later to find out that he had a misunderstanding with his inne, and she broke up with him. So maybe the shame of it and how to face me made him run away. Please. My son is not a coward. He can just leave the country just because of his in there. Because of that, no. The young man was heartbroken. I could see it in his eyes. I know what I'm talking about. Maybe I should just give him a call. His number has been unreachable since he traveled. And no one has heard from him. Is this, is this serious? Travel three days. Oh, boy, Please sit down. Thank you, 
Her Majesty. Um, I've come to let you know that your son, the prince, cannot put my daughter in the family way and abandon her just like that. It's indeed a very shameful thing that shouldn't be let out in public. I decided to let him be because I really don't have any need for him to be around. But this is a serious matter. It's an emergency. So I will send for him and he will be back as soon as possible. Your Highness, uh, that, that, that is okay. That is okay. Let's leave it like that. No problem. <sighs> is it me? Yes, Your Majesty. You are sure? The prince is responsible for the pregnancy? Yes, Your Majesty. I've never lived with any man before. All right. And who else knows about this? No one else, Your Majesty. All right, let's keep it that way. We will do our best to bring both of you back together. And if for no other reason, at least for the child you're carrying in your womb. All right? Thank you, Your Majesty. And both of you will get you, married. Thank you. Thank you, Your Majesty. You're welcome. Ayelele, ayelele, mama le, mama le 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 le. Greetings, my princess. Oh, my princess, I want to teach you something. Okay. Good. My princess, henceforth, I want you to be meeting your husband alone. My princess, you have to listen to me. I want to teach you something. No, husband will take the baby away. No, look. I want you to be meeting your husband alone. Okay? Anytime, any day you want to meet him, just go and meet him. Especially at night. No. My princess, you have to listen to me. You have to meet him, okay? Okay. Are you sure? Okay. That's my princess, Angie Baby. <laughs> I'm happy now. <laughs> Cause you was depressed, now you abusing me That's why I need to care about the truth of me Nobody gave me no arrogance I don't know, smile is on fire I need to go in my life I need to go to my life Fuck this process Did you speak to the prince today? Let's get off the phone with him a minute ago. Okay. When did he say he'll be returning home? He did say. I'll call him tomorrow. He has to come home. Are you missing him that much? <laughs> I need him to come and do something for me. Wow. Nice to see 
you're trying to um, give him some responsibilities. Nice of you. What about the princess? Have you visited them yet? No, I haven't. I really can't have momentum to call her. Every time I pick up the phone, I just... I don't have the courage. Anyway, don't let it take too long. I'll be seeing Godwin tomorrow. So that will be a great opportunity for you to go and see Jineka when he's not at home. Okay, I'll do that. Allow me to call mother and inform her how badly your husband is maltreating you. Please. No. Leave him alone. But my princess, he needs to be cautioned. Please. No. Mother will want to take me back home. My princess, you mean you don't want to go back to the palace? I like God woman. I want to stay here. Okay. If you like him and you want to stay here, fine. But please, allow me to call mother. Mother needs to know that he does not like you. Okay? Allow me to call her to tell him to like you. Please. No. Do call mother. You will live here and I will stay alone. My princess, trust me, okay? I will tell her in a way she will not cause trouble. No. If you tell her, I will make you go. I will stay here alone. Where are you going to? Mom. Eh? I'm looking for my husband. Your husband? Your husband went out, eh, but he'll soon come back. Oh? Eh, come, let's go inside and wait for you. Mm, no! Nah. I say your husband went out. He'll soon be back. Come, let's enter the nah. nah. Princess, stop the. Eh, where, your, where are your slippers? Put your leg. Put your leg. Put your leg now. Put your leg. Hold your hand. Come. Let's go. My son's wife. Godwin's wife. Come, let's. Is he coming back? Yes, he's coming back. He has got to bring something for you. Come, let's go. Come, let's go now. My fine wife. How many time? Let's go. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Let's go. Oh, hey, we don't want you. We don't want you. 
Raise your leg, raise your leg. Raise your leg now, raise your leg. Godwin's wife. Come, come. Come, come now. Help. Let's go. Do you know that Mr. Godwin has refused to subscribe because of Princess? Why? He, because he does not want the Princess to come down to the living room and watch the television. Because that was the fake? Yes. Oh. Uh, excuse me. Welcome, my queen. Ma, Welcome, my queen. Thank you so much. You and your son are doing a great job. Look at my princess. She looks well taken care of. Ah, it's nothing, my queen. <laughs> we are trying our best. Please, what can we offer you? Oh, don't bother yourself. You're doing great already. <laughs> no. We are not so happy. We, we have more time okay. to ask this matter. Why? I don't really want to drink, but because my princess said so, I will. Go and get some wine for the queen. Okay. And princess, you don't have to be calling me whether you want to me. That's wrong. Okay. That wins my Those who sold their slaves in the marketplace do not go back to console them. And you look very angry. But you don't have to spit at anybody from the royal family. What is wrong with you? I know you think we're not into marrying the princess, but you should take it easy. Did you say Lord? I was forced. I never raped the princess and you know this. May stay out of this. God, I am not your enemy. It is your pride and ego that you are at war with. But you need to sell it, kill it. As a matter of fact, you should see yourself, count yourself lucky for being able to marry the princess. If the royal household wanted to honor me by asking me to marry the princess, why didn't they just ask nicely? Why hang out my neck like some plague? Did you say you honored me by forcing me to marry the princess? I asked to what level was I honored actually? Who do we? Like you walked out on me? Does the prince know that you're pregnant? No, Your Majesty. Why would you be pregnant for a man for months and not let him know? Your Majesty, I, the day I tried telling him, he was with Ezine and he refused giving me listening ears. You should have still found a way to tell him. He started avoiding me and he never wanted to have anything to do with me. Emily. Your Majesty. Do you know you could have died trying to abort this pregnancy? 
It would have been success for your majesty. The drugs my father found was supposed to be the last dose. You wanted to do away with this pregnancy and you had to wait for months and months. Why? There was no money. That is why. Oh no. My king. From now on she will live in the palace with us. So that she and the baby will be taken good care of. You know she is my command. She will be taken to the family hospital so that the doctor can run some tests of she and the baby to ensure that no damage has been done by reason of the drugs she took. Thank you. Is in there? Yes, Daddy. Where are you going? Daddy, I told you I have a bell on the way. So I have to go to the shop to wait for my suppliers so I can receive it. Is in there? Is in there? <gasps> ah, it is this your stubbornness that almost made you lose your golden opportunity with the prince. Eh? So you've not learned your lesson. Is that what you want to tell me? Daddy, so I should stop doing my business because I want to marry the prince. That is not what I'm saying. What I'm trying to say is that you will go there now and start lifting heavy bags. Not remembering what you are carrying. Eh? Mm -hmm. That is ex what I'm saying. Okay, Daddy, it's okay. I won't lift heavy bag. Since your fear is that I may lose the pregnancy. Exactly. Remember that what you are carrying there is a prince. A royal blood is not to be toyed with. Huh? Eh? Okay, Daddy. I've heard you. See, let me tell you. Remember that the prince will be coming back very soon. Okay. Don't stress yourself and even stress this baby. Eh? I don't want him to come here and see you stressed up. Because I know that once he comes back and hear your condition, definitely he will rush back down to this place to see you. So I don't want him to come here and we don't see you. Eh? Okay. Or see you stressed up. So take time and do what you are doing. Do you understand? Okay, Daddy. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. That's good. But can I go now? Yes, but make sure you eat. I will, thank you, Daddy. Don't be hungry. Okay. Don't keep this baby hungry. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you. Remember, he is a prince. Yes, Daddy. A royal blood. <laughs> Do you understand me? <laughs> I've said my own. Oh, Why is it taking you so long to attend this? Why is the project not being worked on? Oh my queen, I tried. But... But what? I paid you. I paid you in full. Oh yes, I know. I tried. He said he doesn't want to continue. Why? Um, I don't know, my queen. He said he's not mentally stable for music right now. And he rejected the sponsorship. Did you tell him what's from me? No. Anyway, I have another assignment for you. At your service, my queen. I need you to try to convince him. Talk to him, drag him. Convince him, go to his house, make him come back to music. I don't care what it takes. That's not a problem, my queen. But I don't have his new address. 
I thought you were friends. Oh, yes, we were. Well, we had a misunderstanding that made him lose confidence in me. Okay, I will give you his address. But I need you to convince him. Do whatever you can do. I need him back into music. Because if you fail me, trust me, you will pay me every cover that I give you. And with your trust. And I'm not playing. I will not fail. want you to hear this from someone else. Uh, Mackin, what is it? Emily, Onowu's daughter, is pregnant for my son, the prince. What? Yes. She was here earlier with her father and she said the prince and herself have been having a secret affair. Hmm. Hey! Girls of these days, eh? Hey! As we speak right now, she's in the palace. Ah! Uh, how? What is she doing here, my king? She will stay here with us until she puts to bed. My king, I don't understand what you mean by that. She is carrying the prince's child. And my daughter is in there. She's also carrying the prince's child. She was the first to report to you about her pregnancy. And you didn't give her this kind of attention. Listen, Emily's case is different. She tried to harm herself and the baby. She was caught taking some abortion pills. So I requested that she should stay here in the palace so that she'll be under my watch. <laughs> uh, my king. Please don't make me believe that you are taking advantage of our friendship. Yes. How do you mean? If there is anybody that needs this royal attention, it should be a sin my daughter. Because her own relationship with the prince was officially pronounced. Huh? But instead, you went and gave it to that good for nothing a, a wayward girl eh? that every man in Kanegu knows as Donatus, a free giver. My, my king, check in here. Listen, listen. Until the prince returns, I cannot say anything about that. Uh, okay, I, I, I see. Please don't be offended, my friend. Who am I to be offended by the king? Who am I? You have the final say. And you have said until your son returns. No, no problem, let's leave it like that. Let's leave it like that. I'm going to talk about check, 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 So how is our daughter doing? Oh, she's doing pretty good, I must confess. That's good to hear. So the young man is not misbehaving. I don't want to talk about that before. That reminds me, I was uh, supposed to have a meeting with him today. I guess you said so. Did you not come? I don't know. I was taking care of some issues. Uh, but I would have been told if he had, if he had come here. Maybe you should ask someone. Because I was over there earlier yeah, and I didn't see him. Um, wisdom. Your Majesty. Was Godwin here today? Not at all, my king. All right, thank you. You can go. Thank you, my king. Probably go over there. 
Anyway, my lord, I need to go back in the session. There's something I want to discuss with you. Okay. Ono was here with his daughter, and she claims to be pregnant for the prince. Preg what? I was marveled to hear that, but, but of course the young man in question was not around, so I couldn't immediately confirm. But her father brought her in a life-threatening condition, so I had to take her in. I don't understand you, please. What are you talking about? She was caught taking abortion pills, and you know that is dangerous. It can take her life. Who cares? She can die of all I care. But wait a minute. Why would you bring a girl that has done all that into her inside the palace? Do you want her to die here? She has been examined by the doctor and as we speak right now, she's being treated. And she leaves after the treatment? She stays here to have the baby. And then what? Then the two people concerned will, will decide what they want to do. No way. But, by the way, what makes you think she's actually saying the truth? Well, I've heard her son brag about having good times with her. There's no guarantee that he's responsible for that pregnancy. You are. First of all, it was Ezine. Now, Amy, you seem to believe these wayward, foolish girls. And why do you want to bring them inside this palace anyway? Is your son any better than them? Why would he get involved with, with the so-called wayward girls knowing his status as the prince? I am sure it meant nothing to him. He was just having fun. Oh, I see. You're defending him as usual. But this time around, he will take responsibility for his actions. What are you going to do? You're going to make him marry the two girls? I have not decided on that yet. <sighs> Sorry to disappoint you. I will let you do that to my son. He's indeed your son. That's why he's behaving like this, like mother, like son. If indeed it wasn't on his way back here, I would have asked him to stay back there. What's the point of coming here? Then he might as well kiss the throne goodbye. <laughs> oh my goodness. Of what good is a throne that is embedded with shame? He could make a good life out of himself. Stop coming back to this shame. This shame you call the throne. Please, excuse me. Yes, I did. You did not tell me when you had a plan B, when you changed to the plan B. You did not tell me. What are you talking about? You don't know what I'm talking about? Yes, of course. The pregnancy. Ah. ah. You didn't tell me about your daughter, Sida. My daughter's own was an ongoing plan. You would have told me when you decided to change to, to, to another plan. Would have told me. My daughter's pregnancy has nothing to do with our plans to take over the throne. You think you are smart? I beg your pardon. <laughs> My pardon refused to be begged. Look, let me tell you. Go and cut off that drama you deposited at the palace. Go and cut it off because I will not watch and allow it play for long. Do you hear me? I will not watch it play for long. Go and cut it off. Oh. Did you come out here to, to scold me like, like your child? Don't dare betray me. Don't dare betray me. Do you get me? Henceforth, I am no longer a party to your crimes. Hmm. Look at how stupid you are. I thought you are sensible enough. I thought you have wisdom. But I don't know that I overestimated you. Look, we are partners in crime. We started this thing together and we must finish it together. Do you hear me? We must finish it together. 
I'm not indebted to you in any way. And I will no longer be a party to whatever crime or whatever you are talking about. I'm no longer with you. Good day. <laughs> Look at you. Let me remind you that we are partners in crime. We started it together and we must end it together. I will call you whenever I need you. Yes. You think you are smart. Look at you. I thought you we are playing together. I didn't know you are you have something else in mind. Don't worry. I will show you that I am a boyfi. Obwefi. But Emily is not the only one who's pregnant for you. So why are you so excited about her presence here? Oh yeah. That, that's where my heart belongs. You lie. That's never gonna happen. If this is that easy, then I will understand it. But this wild dog called Emily. She's not coming to my house. Mom, you can say bad things about her, but it is not going to change my mind. She's the one I want. Dad, you need to talk to your wife. She's your mother.
And so why, why didn't you tell me you were pregnant? If you had told me, I wouldn't have been involved with Izini. And I wouldn't have been into this complication. I wasn't ready for marriage. That's why I didn't tell you. And besides, your first child's mother is your first wife. And now? Now what? Are you ready? To do what? To get married. Do I have a choice? Anyways, welcome back home. Jesus! My friend, my, friend, my friend, wake up! Wake up! What are you doing here? And how did you get in here? Come back. Sleep. Oh, good they kill you. You are not sleep. Oh, my friend, will you leave this place before I beat you like a little child? No. No? Mother, no. The door. I can't leave. Mother, the queen was here. Husband, mother. Eh. Hello, Nne. Nne, please come and open this door. No, come and open this door. I'll kill this girl, yo. I'll kill her, yeah. Eh. Uh -huh. No so bad, no problems. Now leave this room. Leave the. My, my friend. My friend. I'll kill you here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. God. Sincerely, I won't tolerate this. I won't tolerate this. You're supposed to be on my side. Your son's side. Instead, you are with my enemies. I'm sorry. I was only trying to help. They forced me to marry her. Now you are forcing me to sleep with her. Who does that? Am I the only man in Kaneku? Eh, uh, Ozula. It will happen again. Am I messy? It will repeat itself. No. For it not to repeat itself, you have to leave. What? Godwin, you're asking me to leave? Your Lee, mother? Lee, you you're chasing me out of your You are have no use here. Go back to the village. Or better still, go to the palace. The queen will be happy to have you back. You're stretching this whole matter. You're, you're stretching it too far. <laughs> I said I, it would happen again. I'm sorry. It's okay. Eh? It's okay. Stop dwelling on it. I read what he said. I won't try it again. Let's go. Please, I'm so sorry. It's all my fault. Please do not treat your mom like this. Will you shut that hole in your face? I'm sorry, Dad. How dare you? Why am I even, even having this conversation? Alright. Hey! Godwin, stop all this now. Why am I having this conversation? What nonsense! Calm down! Promise, Your Majesty. Tell Wisdom to go and find out why Godwin refused to come and see me yesterday as I instructed. Thank you. 
morning sun. I hope you had a good night's sleep. Oh, yes, I did. And you did. Good. Though I spent half of it thinking about the mess you left behind before you traveled. This is no mess, Dad. I mean, I'm an adult. And um, I had something special with this, with these young ladies. I mean, pregnancy is the end result of two opposite sex spending time together. So you're proud of what you did? No, I'm not. I told them I'm making it this happen, it has happened. And what do you intend to do about it? Nothing. What do you mean, nothing? You put two top citizens of this kingdom in the family way and you tell me you're doing nothing about it? Have you forgotten that their fathers are top lawmakers in my cabinet? But Dad, no one is going to victimize me for an offense I did not commit. I mean, <laughs> I did not do anything for someone to victimize me. And these girls are adults. Or did any of them tell you that I raped them or I forced them? Did they say that? At least you should marry one of them. Yes. No. I will not marry any of them, Dad. And why, if I may ask? Because I remember you glowing over the news that Emily was here in the palace. Dad, can we just drop this topic? I think it is too early for us to be discussing I mean, such distressing matters. You have two days to think about it and give me an answer. Two days. To help me. Don't worry, Sister Esther. Everything will be all right. God is able. I don't even know how to say it. I mean, ever since God and my son got married, he started to change completely. But I got me married, and nobody told me about it. Pastor, please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Everything just happened like a dream. Oh my God, this is not right. And to think you've been coming to church all this while and you didn't bother to tell me. Pastor, it was the circumstance that surrounded the marriage. Like I said, it happened like a dream. Please forgive us. Anyway, it's all right, Sister Esther. There is nothing God cannot do. I will keep praying for you and your family. And I know in no distant time, everything will, be, uh, will just fade away. Let's just pray before you leave. Okay. Father, we thank you for this family. We give you all the glory in Jesus' name. Mm -hmm. Everything they are going through, Lord, do it and let glory be given to your name again. Make sure you come to church. Yes, what is it? Young man, Wisdom was there earlier to inform you that you are needed at the palace, but you did not show up. Why? Why? Because I don't go to places where evil is orchestrated. 
That's your response to the king's message. I owe the king nothing, absolutely nothing, and as such, I will not honor the king's invitation. What are you people still doing here? He said, what are you still doing? What are, what are you still doing here? Huh? Idiot. Bad way. I hope you know what you're doing. I'm your mother. You spat on that entitlement when you decided to go against my will. I hope you know what you're doing. Young man. But I'm going to do everything humanly possible to make sure that you and those royal demons stop invading my life! You call me a demon? God, you call me a demon? God, we! Stop! 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 How dare you have this job back? Go and bundle him here right now. Yes, my lord. His father in his lifetime would never flout my order. I think it's time for me to teach that boy a lesson. Go and bring him here right now. Yes, my lord. What nonsense. You have no fear, young man. You dare to disobey my summon. What insolence. I have the right to express myself when something is not pleasing to me, my king. Any more challenging words from you and I'll have your tongue cut off. I'm sorry, my king. Leave! Now, yes, Your Majesty. when you cry. Please. My princess. Yes. Come, my, let's go my, inside. My father must have the gospel. No problem. Come, let's go inside. Oh, stop crying. Ah, he's here. Your husband is back. Ah. He's there. Your husband is there. Hold your wife now. What are you doing? Come. Your husband is here. Come, let's go. Come, let's go. He's here. Come, let's go. Come and give me a happy hand. Your husband is back. Come, let's go. Come, let's go. Esinde, what do you mean by you? What do you mean by that? Dad, please, what am I going to the palace to do? To see the prince, of course. I yes. Didn't, I didn't tell you I want to see the prince. But you have to go and see him. I won't do that. What? You won't do that. Look, you have to listen to me. I am your father. I have to tell you what to do. You are my father and it is my life. I decide how to live it. It is your life and you decide how to live it. You decide how to live it. Yes, in there. All this your shakara will not help you. All this your ten couple shakara will not lead you to anywhere. I know you know that you have a rival. Dad, please, 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 please. What? 
Please what? I said, please what is in there? Eh? Look, I forbid you from bringing this child into this world out of wedlock. Not in this house. How can you do? Look, you have to go to the palace and see and see the prince so that both of you will sort things out. Isn't that you hearing me? Is by what I'm saying entering into your skull? Isn't it? Please, please, please. Just leave me alone. Sorry for last night. Thank God it's not good for you. Oh, well, Ma, you know, um, uh, we've never thought of um, getting married. Marriage is the least thing we thought about while we're meeting each other. I don't even believe that you're responsible for that pregnancy. I think she'd be cheated by one of her lovers. That's why she came to you. Ma'am, ma'am, Jenny will have to prove that. You're not marrying that girl. I will not, but DNA will prove it as soon as she gave birth to the child. You are not bringing her into her family. Mom, just let your mind be at peace. I am not bringing her. I will not get married to her. But you love that girl. You loved her. Why would you want to just leave her now that she's uh, pregnant with a baby? Why? Mom, she, she, she's too proud. I mean, her audacity. Mom, I mean, I will be so irritated with her. I cannot settle down with a woman that, you know, that is so pompous, that raises shoulders with, nice. with men. I can't. Oh, calm down. You can walk on her. She's a woman. She's cool headed. It doesn't matter how you see her. Trust me. Once you set your eyes on her, you, you probably change your mind. I am not going to see her, and I will not see her. She's carrying your child, you know. Mom, please, can we just forget about this whole thing? Please. When was the last time you saw a sister? Exactly what I want to do is the long I saw my sister, so let me go and see my sister. All right. Please talk about to see if you want to. I'm sorry, I'll not. Just be good. Why are you so scared? I learned from someone else, did I? Madam Esther, you are really unfair. Thanks. Thank you. It's okay. Gee, how are you? You don't want to talk to me. Hmm? Don't you? Okay, tell me, what did I do? You didn't plan me that problem. Don't you? I, I, I did not plan trouble. You just came up like that. Hmm? Yeah, I'm sorry. Hmm? I joke, you see. Um, She's just gonna talk to her for you. Angie, my sauce wife, forgive your brother now. He said he's sorry. Uh, okay. Nah. okay, see, see. I'm going to make it up to you, okay? Mm -hmm. I'll take you out. <laughs> I'll take you out and buy you uh, suya. Uh -huh. Yes, I'll see her. I know that is what you like. She's happy now. Angie. Look, I like it. <laughs> 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 Why are both of you fighting over this? Your Majesty, my daughter was the first to get pregnant for the prince, so she should be the one he will marry. Look at you. Look at you. Shameless or no. Look at you fighting for that, your pure, pure, pure daughter. Look, imagine, imagine. 
It is your daughter that is plum plum plum. Yes, it's your daughter. You are becoming more selfish by the day. Ah. Yes. Uh, my, my king, I smell a foul play here. I smell a foul play. That is, daughter's pregnancy is not for the prince. I can authoritatively say it. Look, let me tell you. Go and look for the person that got your daughter pregnant. Don't come here and talk nonsense before the king. Don't come here and, and uh, talk nonsense and say it, it, it is the prince. Do you hear me? Look at this Obo Koko. Eh? Eh. If not the prince, then it's you. You are calling me Obo Koko. Yes! You are Obo Mado. Me? That's what you are. Myself? Obo Mado. Oh no. Obo Efi. My king. I did not invite both of you here to come and insult yourselves before me. My apologies, Your Highness. I'm sorry, my king. Ordinarily, I would have left this matter to be decided by the prince himself. And anyone he chooses, then I'll compensate the other person. But there's a problem. What problem? What problem? The prince has refused to marry any of your daughters. <laughs> no, your, your majesty. This, this is unacceptable. He cannot use my daughter and dump, dump her like that. No. My king, <laughs> I will not accept this. So it is not possible. He will marry my daughter. Ha! Nobody be kanako. Anakuda kunkako. Well, we have a situation in our hands. That is why I called for a council meeting to discuss this matter and thrash it out. But I needed to inform you first. Because I will not take it to. I will not take it to. My, my, my daughter that is a virgin, the prince will destroy her and uh, no, it will not happen. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. Yeah. Good afternoon, my princess. Good afternoon. <laughs> oh, ma. This is Dean Sound, Mr. Golden's friend. Oh, really? Please sit. Thank you, ma. Okay. I go and call the son to you. Okay. <sighs> opportunity and make good use of it. <laughs> oh no. Eh? See, look at the plan we have been struggling to execute eh. has finally fallen into our hands. Bam! Giddy bam! Exactly. On his own. On his own. <laughs> you see? Oh, wait, see, no one knows tomorrow. Uh -huh. eh? Sometimes it's good to give chance for time to play. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> The prince cannot mess with our daughters and go scotland. It is not possible. Cha -cha eh? So we will use this and attack him and then execute our plans. Yes, yes. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Your wife, the princess, is beautiful. What are you doing here, Dean? And by the way, how did you find my address? <laughs> you 
you are the son-in-law to the king. And that makes you a very influential person in this city. So, finding you can be that hard. So what do you want? Let's do your son. I told you I do not want to. I don't understand why you suddenly lost interest in music. It's personal. Well, since you say it's personal, I'll respect your privacy. But you can come to the studio once in a while. Maybe that could help you get your zeal back. It's all good. I'll consider that. I'll believe you. All right, then. Take care, man. Yeah. Take care. everything, everything my father did, you know, to bring you in, make you comfortable, I mean, even your parents. But when I came back, you, Emily, you rejected me. I didn't mean to. I was, I, I was happy to see you. I was even looking forward to you making it official. And exactly what I was about to do. I was going to do it. I'm sorry. Just... Just my hormones acting up. You know pregnancy can make women develop mood swings. I'm just... I'm sorry. So, Emily... Will you marry me? Yes, I will marry you. I want to be your queen and the mother of your children. I will marry you. You already have one baby. You carry one already. Mm -hmm. So three more to go. It's me, Onji, baby. It's me, Grace. So, Grace, your friend. Smile for me now. Onji is a fine girl. Yeah, yeah, oh, 
What is happening here? Why is she looking this sad? Hey. Huh? Ma, this is how she has been behaving. Can you imagine last night? She was crying all through. She was crying? Yes. And what is the problem? Ma, she's been moody all day. Can you imagine? Uh -huh. She cried all through the night yesterday. She was crying? Why? It's because of Mr. Godwin. Look, Ma, I know you've tried your best for Mr. Godwin to accept her. That is why I don't want to pressurize you. So all these things happen and you, you, you didn't tell me. Eh? You didn't tell me. It's okay. My princess. Don't worry. Everything is going to be all right. Yes. I will talk to my son. You know, go. Hey, God. Indy, baby. Smile for it's me. It's okay, sis. Come, 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 come. Come, come. Come. Mama Lee Cham is okay. Come now. I promise you I will talk to my son. Hmm? My son will love you. That's why for me. It's me, Grace. Oh. Grace, see your friend. Don't you, baby? It's why for me now. Why will you ask the maidens to take away Emily's royal attires? Why? Why did they take it off? If she's not royalty, and she will never be royalty. No, mother, she's going to be royalty as soon as I get married to her. Automatically, she becomes a royalty. Oh, by my dead body! You will not bring that girl to my home. Did you hear me? Did you hear me? My mom. Don't worry. When you see this, What are you doing here and who are you? I'm very sorry that the princess is driving as a matter of fact. I've never set my eyes on her before, so I guess she was about and decided to go see You don't person. have any right to be here. You have to go now. Yes. Nobody is allowed to see the princess. Okay. I just leave. Whenever she's ready to go out, you let me know. Just leave. Just go. And please, next time, if you want to enter the princess room, don't dress like this. Bye. Stop there. Yes. What is yes? Are you mad? You go. Over. Sorry, what do you want? I've seen you go to the storeroom three times now. What are you doing there? Snacks for the princess. Snacks for the princess? Yes. So you want to tell me that it's the princess that's been eating and taking all the snacks and the juice from the storeroom? Yes, of course. <laughs> Grace, you think I don't know what your plans? You think I don't know what you're doing? So you're storing all these things so that you can take them home on your off day and you're telling me it's the princess? No, God forbid that I will steal from the royal house. I am not a thief and you know that. The snacks and the drinks are for the princess. Grace, don't lie to me because I will report you to the queen now. Speak, my friend. I'm sorry. Speak! Princess. God came to the princess room and the princess has refused to let him go. God only came to the princess room and she has refused him to go. Yes. Please don't report me to the queen. Please, I beg you. You can go, you can go, you can go. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Hmm. This is an opportunity for me to help the queen. I will frame Godwin up so the queen can carry out her plans of marrying the princess to Godwin. Yes. Please. The queen is buying your testimony against Godwin. Just talking. 
But I don't really know what happened. How can you say so? You were there now. You saw the thumbpunt when you came in. You saw him rape the uh, princess. Wait. J just wait. Is this all about the princess getting married to Godwin? Yes, now. Is there any other thing that we are fighting for? Well, she has my testimony already. I'm just doing all these things because I love the princess. And besides, I want the princess to get married like every other woman. Finish. Now we are on point. So what you do is, you will find a way. Meet me like that gets me any of her belongings. Okay? Please. 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 Leave me alone. Take one. This is one place. I hope I'm doing the right thing. I had to book the room after the palace guard raped her. So I'll see everything, everything that is going on in there. Good. So what are you going to do with that footage? I'm going to take it to the elders in council tomorrow and show it to them if you don't see clear my way with Emily. Do you blackmail me? All I need is a cooperation. Who else in this house would you put all these for stupid families? Huh? Come back here. Come back here, Polly, you cheat. my son turn to a beast before my very eyes. He will come around, ma. You said so yourself. Please, don't go. Don't leave me here. I can't handle this situation alone. Please, I beg you. My son wants me to leave. Let me go. Let me go so that we have time to carry out that rage in his blood. Then later his eyes will clear. Let me go. He will come around, ma. Me, you you, me, said, no, you no, said so no, yourself. No, no, ma, please. No, 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 Chef making again today? Do you have a question? I think so. Okay. My queen, you said for me. So I was doing something for the king. Thank you. Can you get me a professional to look around this palace for hidden cameras? Search the rooms outside, around, and do that immediately. So many ways to kill a rat. No. The prince proposed to my daughter. Huh? Yes. He did? Uh, she called me today to inform me about how the prince was uh, pleading with her to accept his marriage proposal. Okay. Um, whether he marries her or not, our plans still remain, right? Uh, that is why I'm here to see you. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> you see, um, isn't this pregnancy still fresh? We can do away with that and uh, use my daughter only to achieve our plans. Mm. Oh no, <laughs> Oh no, Where is he? Mm. I smell a power play here. Yes, I smell a power play. Oh no, 
The problem with you is that you don't trust me. You don't trust me. How can we achieve our plans if you do not trust me? Oh no, I don't trust you. I don't trust you. Eh? How can I trust you? When you cunningly brought in your daughter without telling me. You brought her in so that she will, she will, she will take over without informing me. Then you want me to come and trust you. No, no way. I will not trust you, oh, oh, no. Abuifi, Abuifi, let us not miss this golden opportunity by fighting ourselves. Eh? Yeah, our daughter is dull and cannot play this game for us. Mm. Yes. <laughs> your daughter is dull and cannot play this game for us. And your own daughter is very sharp, as sharp as razor blade. And can play this game very, very well for us. Oh no, clap for yourself. <laughs> clap for yourself. Well rehearsed already. Now, get out of my compound. Hmm? Yes, get out of my compound. Look, my daughter already has the pins on her palms. You should walk with them. I would rather give up the plans than working with a deceiver, a betrayer like you. Yes! Get out. Uh, has he gotten to that? Insulting yes, get out, me? you stupid man. Get out. You insulting me? Get out from my compound. It, look, I don't want to descend on you. Start going. Has he come to insult I said start going. Leave my compound. Go, 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 go. Has he gotten to that? He started going to go. Don't allow me to release my dog on you. Your yeah, dog? Oh, yeah, I say, Tiger! I will leave your Look at what you are saying. I had good plans with you. Look at the way you you are cunningly trying to destroy it, and you you want me to trust you. I can never trust you. No, no, no. If I see your leg here again, trying to 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 make me believe you in you, you will see what I will do to you. Stupid man. Okay, you will see. <laughs> What is all this? What is all this? What is this snake in the monkey shadow moves now? What is this? Why are you spoiling my video? <laughs> my friend, will you, will you stop this nonsense? Look for somebody to dance like a snake in a monkey shadow dance with. Nonsense. to do something. If not, Godwin will help the princess someday. Where is his mother? At her place. I tried to beg the princess to come back with me, but she refused. My, my queen, 
you have to call the princess to come back home. Because if the crisis continues, I fear I can't handle it alone. You will not go back there. You will not go back there. Ah. You're going to leave them alone. If Godwin wants to harm her, let him go ahead. But he will pay for the consequences. Uh, my queen, please, do not leave my princess alone with him. It's too dangerous. Please. Let him go ahead and do what he wants to do. I've told you that. You will not go back there. They are newly married. So you need to leave them alone. My queen, please, allow me to go back and stay with her. I know what I'm saying. I will not forgive myself if anything happened to the princess. Please. Chris, I will say this one more time. You will not go back there. And now, leave. Go back to the maid's quarters. When we need you, we call you. My queen, please. I said leave. Please. Please. Allow me to go stay with the princess, please. God! I'm sorry. You need to stop taking too much of alcohol. But it will make the baby strong. I don't want the baby to be that strong, and I'm serious about this. You need to stop it. So, what do you want me to take? Sweeping drinks that will make me stool. But actually, they are drinks for pregnant women. Thank you, I'm not interested. No, no, no. I don't want you to take this as well. So what? Um, you truly need to stop. Um, I mean, you need to start living decently. But you know you can't stop me from smoking and drinking. Emily, very soon you're going to be the queen of this kingdom. And your life needs to change. Live a decent life. Now see who is preaching. You could change easily, doesn't mean the whole world should change with you. You know, that also could also cause deformity for the baby. You met me like this. You chose me. I mean, why are you acting like you never knew any of my habits? Come on. <sighs> well, I don't think this marriage is going to work. If you don't change. Why are you sounding like you're doing me a favor? Well, I'm in the car. I'm outside. Come on, you're ready. You better wait for me. Oh? One K likes and five hundred shares. Wow, this is good. Who is this one again? One 
gain likes and 500 shares in two hours. Wow! <laughs> Who does that? Can you beat that? Woohoo! Ah. Is this not the same lady that sent me? See you. with a knife. Please put it, put it down, okay? What are you talking about? Please put it down before you hurt yourself. If anything happens to you, then everyone will think I did it. Tomorrow morning, I need that lock down. And no mistakes. Yes, ma'am. I don't want any excuses. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Princess, it's really nice to hear you. It's today I'm here. <laughs> See you happy. I'm not going to get married to Emily or Izzy. Prince Chidi, 
What makes you think you can mess up with our girls and go scot for <laughs> I don't understand what you mean by mess with your girls. I am aware of only one getting pregnant, which is Emily. So you are denying you don't have anything to do with Ezine's pregnancy? Ezine, Ezine and I had an argument that led to our disengagement. And ever since I came back, I have not set my eyes on her. This is the first time I'm seeing her. I only get to hear about her pregnancy from someone else. Is he drunk? You are telling us that you don't even know that he's in the experiment for you. Or maybe she's not bold enough to say it to my face. Maybe she's lying. You can ask your well of a daughter who got her pregnant, not me. Prince Chief. Uh, I think we are deviating from the reason we are here. Is, in the, is the prince saying the truth? Speak up, Nesine. Eh? Why are you keeping quiet? Stop! Let her be. Your Highness, Prince Chad should tell us the reason of saying that we will not marry her with her first gas to God. Don't just get it. Yes. I don't even know if you know your explanation. Chidi. Okay, this is it. I, I found out I couldn't cope with Emily. So, this is what I am going to do. I am going to pay for her bride price and I am doing that just because she is pregnant. Else I will do it. Please, Chidi. You can keep your bride price. I don't need it. I'll keep my daughter and my grandchild. Oh no. Don't be offended. He doesn't know what he's saying. Your Majesty, the prince committed a grave crime by messing up with our girls. Oh. It's not as if we don't know the law, but we choose to ignore him because of our standing relationship with you. But if he thinks he can get away with this, he's a dreamer. He cannot. He cannot get away. Is it I'm ashamed of you? So ashamed of you? Eh? Dad, please don't add to my pains. That pains kill you there. Let it kill you there, stupid girl. Open your mouth and talk. No, you will not talk. You, 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 you become dumb all of a sudden. No, no way, it's good to see. I was lost in the middle of the whole drama. The drama, yes. Stupid actions gave birth to her. Wendy, please came back. Did I not tell you to go and meet him so that you would sort things out? But you refused. You bluntly refused. You disobeyed me. Dad, I didn't want to see him because he really hurt me. He really hurt you. You discovered that you were pregnant when the prince was born. When he came back, we are you not supposed to have gone to him to explain things? But you refused because you feel you know more than your father. You are sensible more than your father. Dad, does that justify his action for denying me like a common girl? I will go and sort that one out. I will deal with that one. <laughs> you disappointed me. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, Father. I'm sorry. God, I'm sorry I failed you. Look at the way you have a bachelor. You have a bachelor. You have a bachelor. Hey! I have a bachelor. I have a bachelor. I have a bachelor. I have a bachelor.
You are not my blood, Chidi. You are a disgrace to the throne of my fathers. I doubt if you're my blood. Sorry. I'm sorry to have disappointed you. But you shouldn't have used those words on me. You? I will teach you a lesson you live to tell your children. You had better take this boy to his father. Because he cannot be my son. I do not take back my words. This boy cannot be my son. Such a fool cannot come from my loins. I'm sorry, my queen. The coast is not clear yet, that is why. Are you stupid? All right, my Why are you sounding so incompetent? Just the two assignments, you can't even get it done. You have the F1 to come and tell me that it's not done. I'm sorry, my queen. What is wrong with you? If the coast is not clear, clear it. Clear it for crying out loud. I oh, will. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, let us not keep your friend waiting. Come on. Of course, which is why you're supposed to set good examples. No, what is that? What is that? What must we quarrel each time we meet? Huh? 
Sir, why can't you calm down for once? Eh? No, please. Look, let me tell you. In fact, this is the time we have to come out strong and attack the royal house. You and who? Eh? You and who? I have told you I am no longer interested in working with you. Can't you hear me? Can't you understand? Oh, boy, see. I don't know how you intend to achieve it, but you know you cannot be king without my help. Ah. Yes! All right. Then I will kill you and make another person do know. <laughs> that is just the thing. <laughs> oh, boy. Fortunately, I am not your good that you can slaughter at will. What impunity? Let's imagine you know to threaten to kill me on my face before me. Chidi, I can't let you do this to me. Well, I will try to we could. I will try to pay for your bright prize. But your father turned it down. But that is rubbish. Mm -hmm. Oh well, that I got you pregnant does not mean that. Um, I mean, we, we should get married. Marriage is not by force. But I'm going to be the mother of your son, the heir. And that does not mean that you must be in my life. Now the most important thing there is, he is going to be my first child, my child. And the heir to the throne, when I am no more, or when my father is no more. My son cannot be born out of wedlock. He has to be in this palace. Good. You know, I'm so happy that you know a little bit of tradition. Well, yet. He's not going to be born outside this palace. You're going to give birth to him here. And you're going to take care of him in this palace. And when he gets to five, you can leave. After all, I'm going to pay your bride price. And that is going to make him a legitimate son. That is my legitimate son and the heir to the throne. When I am no more. Chidi, I want more. I want more for my son. Well, that is all I have to offer. And that is totally unacceptable. Really? Yes. You do know that you cannot be king without my help. Yes. Huh? What impunity? Huh? Oh, threaten my life without repulse. He told me that he would kill me right in my face. <laughs> uh, oh, you need to know that I'm not the weakling he thinks I am. A tussle for power, fortune, and fame is bringing so much pain and shame. All, all for selfish gain. It's a shame, a big shame. The effort some people put into planning and plotting of this evil is so appalling. All for selfish needs, powered by greed. Whoa! In the process, the innocent suffers. These people, they don't really care as long as they get what they are after. This is sad, 
What did I ever do to you? We're over. What? Why do you allow yourself to get pregnant? You should have used protection. Since you weren't ready for the outcome of unprotected sex. If every unprotected sex leads to pregnancy, do you know how many hooligans how many hoodlums and how many bastards will be roaming the streets? Do you? Chidi, don't touch me. I gave you my heart. I gave you my body. Heart of the love I have for you. But you crush my heart into pieces. Chidi, please. Don't you there. Next time, you try to stop me properly. I will embarrass you from head to your toes. interested in anything that comes from you. Now what is my friend now? That stupid boy you call your son. He keeps disappearing and showing up with evil traits that are detrimental to his ascension to the throne. And you're doing nothing about it. The fact that I'm not doing the things you want me to do does not mean I'm doing nothing. What you're doing is to take his side and shield him like a mother hen. What do you want him to do? Marry the two girls? The two ladies in question marry both of them at the same time? Of course, I've already dumped a teenage because he doesn't want her. And this wayward one, Emily, what do you want him to do, please? That is the problem. Why did he reject the poor girl? You and I know he's responsible for the paternity of Emily's pregnancy. How do you know that? And how sure are you that this girl is not lying? Girls can be pretentious. What do you want for him? I want anything he wants, and I promise to fight there for him. Any decision he takes, I will be right with him. Bravo. Well done, madam. Well done. Anyway, the good news is, you did take care of and get it about Wow. Congratulations. Thank you. What's the meaning of this? You are my husband. Yes, I know I'm your husband, but I don't like what you're doing. We will do husband and wife. Unji, let me ask you a simple question. What do you know husband and wife do? What happened? She didn't, did you say you made certain lashes? 
Oh, take that word. Simple as I can't carry it out. What did you figure out about that way to give us something else? I'm so sorry. Well, she refused me to do anything else. And I mean, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Simple assignment. You want to put me to avoid the doors. Ah, okay. And then, don't worry, I will figure out um, what to do. Okay? How about making her jump with people? Then can I just out and do abortion drugs? And just, uh, okay. No. That will raise suspicion if it fails. Okay? So we'll see what we'll do. And for now, we'll look for something else to do. Just go, just go, just go, just go. This time around. My king, we found Prince Chidon Wadi to be the crown prince of this land. To that respect, all his position and title as the crown prince must be withdrawn. Um, thank the gods you are full of days and you can still produce another heir. Who we will teach the conducts of being a very good and nice prince. <clears throat> My king, we the elders demand that you marry another woman that will bear you a reputable heir to this throne. Um, my king, Prince Chidi will never be our king when you are no more. Never. You all say I'm still full of days and can marry another wife that will produce another heir that will succeed me. That I will not marry another wife because that will mean shortening my days. Remember, Prince Chad is your only son, my king. Who will you leave the throne of your fathers? You have to marry another woman that will bear you an heir to the throne. I know my king may not wish to take another wife. But uh, may I suggest that um, hence my daughter is pregnant for the prince. The king will soon have a grandson. And uh, the grandson may take over from him when he finally joins his uh, ancestors. Oh no. Your majesty. You want me to make an unborn child the heir to the throne? There's nothing wrong with that, Your Highness. Now listen. I know Prince Chidi is unacceptable by reason of his lifestyle right from the onset. But I don't think your suggestion is proper. My king, please don't mind what Onogu just said. He is not being reasonable. Such thing is not possible at all. Not even in the land where a fool is a king will such happen. Never! <clears throat> uh, my king, you know in a kingdom where there is no crown heir, the most noble among nobles will take up the mantle of leadership. Mm -hmm. For power, fortune, and fame is bringing fullness, pain, and shame. Woman, will you calm down, please? Calm down. All for selfish. Ask me to calm down. I will shame. not calm down. When you are about to give my first to another person, his back right to another stranger. You know him. You've met him. And in the end, you'll be happy with this decision. I will never accept that. I will never accept that decision. You cannot give my son's back right to another stranger. You cannot do that. Never. The throne is mine. And I choose who will succeed me, not you. Let's see how you make that choice without me. Really. 
this is sad. Oh, this is so bad. I'm sorry, my friend. Emily has changed her routine of food. Her choices of meals come unexpectedly. Please, I'm sorry. Who are the food that we brought in that time? What would be our food? Dummies. I'm sorry, my friend. Food? What is wrong with you? Okay, my friend, don't worry. I'll figure out another system too. I, I am no longer interested in this assignment. You know what? This pregnancy has become so important to me that I need to keep it. So you can stop with your stupid behavior and stupid assignment. Do you understand me? So get out. Sorry. Out! Hello, ah, my queen. Eh? Ah, my queen, anything for you. So what would that be? Eh, is that so? It's all right, my queen. Um, I will. Who am I to reject? Yeah, please, my queen. Uh, but uh, uh, I mean, what? What do I gain from from it? If I make it possible. My queen, oh, this is the best offer you have made to me. Consider it done. Ah, no, that will not constitute any problem. Eh, consider it done, my queen. Have you forgotten that I am the owner? Eh? Consider it done. So I will, my queen. Mama, I don't think I can get married to, to Emily. I truly don't think I can get married to her. I just can't stand her at all. My son, that is the only way we can get to Tolu. That's the only way we can win him over. But I, yeah, if you could, at least you can still talk to him. Hmm? You can still talk to him. He means the next in line when it comes to League of Noble people in this community. The same man he publicly denied water, rejected her, denied the pregnancy. Yes, sir. Are you so foolish in your thoughts? Mom, but I can take all that back. Truly, I can. I mean, I mean, I and I and uh, Izzy knew. I, I still feel something for her. We we'll still leave. Shut it. I shut it for you. This is that I practically begged you. I begged you to take her back, but you refused. I don't know that feel something. What's that? That was because I was still angry with her. Whatever you feel for her, you should trash it, kill it, it's not gonna happen. It's final. Please. Please. Please what? What you need to? To now is to start preparing for your marriage. Hopefully the head house will take you back. So we can just start this thing with Emily and get it over with. I don't want Emily. Stop thanking me, okay? Just stop thanking me. I'm only doing my duties as your husband. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, yes. All the people that do this for me, 
palace this is that they are paid or something. Thank, thank you again. I just said you should stop thanking me. I don't have to be paid to do what is expected of me. Mm. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Your father. Hmm? Your Majesty. Okay, yes, my king. We'll, we'll be there in an hour, my king. <laughs> Thank you, my king. Angie. Mommy, I don't want to go there. She come over for crying out loud. Why? Why? That queen will knock me up. How can the queen lock you up? You're, you, you're with your husband. And I don't want to go there. Uji, Uji, if you love me, let us go to the palace, okay? We love you. Yes. Palace. No. What do I do now? I can't leave Uji here all by herself. <laughs> the prince pleaded with me. He was very remorseful about his actions. And um, my daughter also informed me of how he pleaded with her, was begging, as if he was begging for his, for his life. Oh, no. Remember, our decision to uncrown him was not based on the fact that he impregnated our daughters, but. Uh, but uh, um, he never denied responsibility of my daughter's pregnancy, which shows that he is telling the truth. Oh no, don't talk like that. You know he's only a mother that knows the true father of her child. Okay, God. Eh? Remember that the prince is a vagabond. He could have denied it. So we should not insist on him marrying the two girls. Mm, I, I'm sorry, Rick, but um, the prince has shown remorse for his actions. <laughs> So let us give him a chance. Let him marry my daughter. And that after Ezin name was put to bed to prove the paternity of her child, then we shall know what next to do. Hello. Huh? Why are you most concerned about the prince marrying your daughter? If you were in my shoes, wouldn't you do everything possible to make sure that your daughter don't end up in disgrace to you and your household. Uh, Won't you? Uh, oh no. We know that you are trying to secure your own interest. But you should also consider the throne. That boy will bring you a dishonor to this very prestigious throne. I'm telling you the truth. Yes. No, he will change that, I will assure you. Let's give him another chance. He will definitely change. He will not, and uh, that is why. <clears throat> Ah, 
Shawa. You came to see me. No, oh, yes, indeed. So what? How to lie on fire, Inji? Okay, please, please. I brought her here to stay a little. Oh. Yes, for a while. I have a meeting at the palace with the king. I want to go to the palace with Tata. I'm sure the queen would like to see both of you together. I, mean, I begged Inji to come along with me, but she refused. You don't want to go to the palace. No problem. She will stay with me. Yes, Inji. I'll go pick her up and I'll come with you. Let's go. Got the way in the afternoon. I can see yeah. it. I can see it. I love you. Eh? I can see it. Then let's go. Take care of Baba, okay? Ah. Uh -huh. yeah, let's then, go. Eh? Please. Uh -huh. Let's go. Uh -huh. Let's go. Uh -huh. Let's go. 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 Let's You know I have been of help to you in this palace. Eh? This is the time I want you to help me too. I want you to help me to, to do something. I will pay you handsomely. Okay? What do you want me to do for you? I want Emily to lose that pregnancy she is carrying. My son, Prince Chidi, broke not only your trust in him, but also mine. And I'm personally disappointed in him. So I consent to your decision to uncrown him as the heir apparent to the throne of Kanekuland. Your Majesty, may I speak? Speak. Your Majesty, we the elders of this land and the members, the cabinet members to the throne have agreed to plead with you that the prince be forgiven. You spoke earlier on about how you all have agreed to give the prince another chance. Yes, yes, Your Majesty. That was our agreement. I am no more in support. Right. Yes, cut me out. I am no more there. Obuefi. Yes. Why can't, how, how dare you say you are no more? No, I no, said I am no more. No, 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 what you said. I am no more. How can you say that? Only you agree yeah. on that. Only you. Quiet, you quiet, agree. quiet. You do not agree. I say Enough. I am not in support. Enough. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. I hereby decree that Prince Chidi has been uncrowned as the heir apparent to the throne of this land. Your, your Majesty, please, you, you cannot just uncrown the crown prince without providing an alternative. You don't have a son as an alternative heir to the throne. Unless, of course, if you want to state to us here that you want the kingship to leave your village. And who says I do not have an alternative heir? So, 
for power, fortune, and fame is bringing so much pain and shame. All, all. Why are you all surprised and shocked? Is Godwin not my son? How, oh, my king? My king, are you trying to tell us that you had an affair with Leta Mechi's wife? <laughs> you do not understand what I meant when I addressed him as my son? Well, he is married to my daughter, who is the princess of this land. That automatically makes him my son. Am I correct? Yes. Is that not so? Yes. That's it. Yes. Am I correct? Yeah. Yes, sir. My king, you could have told us where you are, where you are driving us. A man's son-in-law is also his son. Uh, yes. Am I correct? You are correct, my king. You are correct. <laughs> Being married to my daughter, the princess of this land, automatically qualifies him to ascend the throne in the absence of any male child. Yes. That's it. Her Majesty, but you have a son. Yeah, please, let's give him another chance. I know he will change. Change? You are talking of change? A son that brings uh, shame and disrespect to his father is not worthy of any inheritance at all. Yes. I stand with the king on this. I stand with him. Yes. Oh, of course now. Ah. Yes. He has no dignity. And any man that will rule Kaniku Kingdom must be a man of honor and integrity. Yes. Any man who could defy our girls and mislead our sons is not worthy to be the king of Kaniku Kingdom. Yes. See, let me tell you. Godwin is a man with enviable potentials. I am sure he will make a good king for Kanye Ubu Kingdom. Yes. 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 He never had any evil reports since. That's, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. A good king. Well, I hereby declare Godwin Amechi the crown prince of Kanye Land the heir apparent to the throne. Ibe! Godwin, Godwin, where are you? Idilika has been crying herself all. She thought that you have uh, abandoned her here and run away. Please do fast and come back. She's really worried. Okay, no problem. Let me go and explain to her. Okay. Mother, you have to take me to my father. This man is not my father. Shut up. Don't add stuff to my injury. My lord, I would never forgive you for this act. Blame yourself. You didn't do a good job with the upbringing of your son. You were busy jumping from one occasion to another. So you give your son's part right to a total stranger. A total stranger. I shall allow this buffoon to throw my crown to those power thirsty fools who call themselves my cabinet members. You love his father. 
You chose the throne over your own son. Over your son. Don't worry. Godwin will do a good job. Don't worry. That boy will never ascend that throne. Be careful what you say. Otherwise, I'll make you sign an undertaking to guarantee his security. Dad, please. I can't bear this, this shame. Do you want me to commit suicide? Is that what you want me to do? You will in hell. The first thing tomorrow morning. I'll... Emily. Wow, what a pleasant surprise, Rhoda. Hi, dear husband. My husband is fine. Uh huh. <laughs> Actually, we were supposed to come together, but something happened, and then he went back to the office. Oh. Okay. Once again, you're welcome, okay? <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank you. Mr. Goldwyn. Yes, Ruda? My husband and I would like to sign you in our music brand. Excuse me, what did, what did you just say? You, you heard me right. R Rona, you must, you must be joking. You what? What are you making in here? you hear that? This is good news. I actually came to know if you would like the offer. Yes, yes. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. Oh, yes, you heard it from my wife. Mm -hmm. We love the offer. Thank <laughs> oh, oh, thank you so much. This is good. You like it? Yeah. I can't wait. You'll have to go back there and make sure you get it done today. I'm sorry, my prince, we can't go back there today. We don't operate like that. You see, we have to give it some days before making another attempt. You don't operate like that? We don't operate like that, I'm sorry, prince. But make sure you get it done as soon as possible. My prince, <clears throat> no shaking. We won't fail you this time. Trust us. Yes. Are you sure? Very sure, very prince. Sure. Very sure. Very, very sure. I like the way you dance. Thank you. We are going to do husband and wife. No? Oh, yes, yes. Of course. We're going to do husband and wife. But first things first. <laughs> Let me go and get us wine. <laughs> okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, no, don't be in a hurry. Wait, I'm coming. <laughs> hey, wait, wait, wait. Should I play the music so you continue dancing? Yes. Huh? Okay. Let me play the music so you continue dancing. I'm coming. Let me get us wine. Eh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Son, you need to go and pay a Norway condolence visit. Why? Why should I do that? The daughter died while in your house. 
and she was your would-be wife. So it's proper that you go and find out how he's doing. Dad, I will not visit on her. I don't owe him. I don't owe him anything. Besides his, his daughter deceived me till she died. So I don't need to pay her any last respect or whatsoever. It's all right if you don't feel like going. I was only suggesting. Thank you very much, Dad. But like I said, I would not pay him a visit. I, I believe he's aware of his daughter's plot. And that is why he's been wallowing in guilt after her death. <laughs> she was his only daughter. You think he'll get over her that easily? Oh, I, I just feel he's not only grieving, but guilty as well. It is written all over him. If when you see him, you will know it's written all over him. Excuse me. Your Highness, she has been crying since last night and refused to be consoled. And when I tried to inquire what the problem was, she finally confessed that she was responsible for what happened to Emily. When I pushed further, she refused to talk. That is why I brought her here, Your Highness. A murderer in my palace? Strange things are really happening in this palace. Speak! Before I order the guards to set your miserable body on fire. It was a movie that sent to me. He said he's not going to hurt her. He assured me that it would only make her get miscarriage. I'm so sorry, Your Highness. I am a Mama Le. Why is everyone wanting his daughter to get married to me? Promise. Go and get her locked up right now. And go and bring me a wifey here now. Yes, I'm so sorry, you're right there. I'm so sorry, you're right there. I'm so sorry. Yes. 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 What is the meaning of all this? Life seemed to be in danger. The other day, my wife and I left my place, left my house. On getting back home, my house was invaded. And now this? Ah. You are joking with your life, man. Yes, you are joking with your life. I mean, how can you keep quiet over something as serious as this? What do you expect me to do? What do you expect? My wife. My wife. What about your wife? I, I, I left us a few minutes ago. Call her, call her, call her, call her. Okay. I need to get her protection. I am not sure she's ready for a baby or if she's in good health to conceive.
It was not my fault. I never knew that what uh, the nobu's daughter was carrying was a fake pregnancy. That does not justify you to kill an innocent girl. Who said she is innocent? No, she was not innocent. She was only acting out the plan of uh, no to take over the throne and kill you. No. No, my that, that wasn't my plan. Eh? It was his plans. In fact, he planned for us to eliminate you and your entire household for his selfish ambition because he wants to take over the throne. I wanted the throne, yes. I wanted to be the king. I know that one. But that of killing you and your household is entirely his idea. My hand was not there. Um, oh no. Mm. There is something I want to discuss with you. I don't know if I can confide in you. What may that be? I want us to change the constitution of Kanekuland. Obuf. What do you want us to add or subtract from our constitution and uh, bylaw. The rulership of Kanebu mm -hmm. should not be vested on one family. It should be rotational among the noble bloodline from decade to decade. Yes. That is what I want us to change. With you. you are making this suggestion because uh, it is to your advantage. Uh, yes, it is. It is. Because I am the next in line after the king. Yes, of course. <laughs> um, oh no. I want to be the king. I want to be the king of Kanegu land. Hmm. I don't want the prince to succeed his father, the present king. I want to be the king. So that is why I want us to do this. I see a mengwangwa, a megarodochi. Let us do it now. This is a tall ambition. That is it. Oh no. You Hey! And um, when I met the king and he agreed that I should bring Ezine so that the prince will marry her, I discovered that Ono became envious of the whole thing. So he started behaving somehow until one day. I, I discovered his plan. Huh? If there is anything I hate about that idiot, it's his authoritative nature. He always stands on his decisions as if we, the cabinet members, don't exist. He's boosting as if he has an heir. Eh? Yeah. That's woman rapper. That is refu. That is going around the town, carrying women around. Eh? Junketing like a junkie is what he's trusting. Mbano, it will not work. It is going to be a shock. You will see it. Why don't you just eliminate him? Eh? <laughs> yes. That seems to be the only way out. No, 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 no. Please don't go that side. Don't go that side. Instead, let us keep pressing the king to see if he can do the right thing. No, 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 no. Not to talk of eliminating. Please. Don't you know the king. If you press him so much for a matter, he will suspend every council meeting and deny us his audience. I know. I know, but 
killing the prince is not the solution. Let us look for another solution eh, that is better than killing him. Ogunfi, if you really want that truth, you have to act fast. You know, the king's days are counting. He will soon join his ancestors, and Prince Jid will be crowned king. No. That boy can never overthrow me. Never. It will not happen. You will see. Hello? Any problem? Huh? I, while we were at the palace, okay. eh, I thought about something. Okay. A very good idea. But before I could finish with the king, you were gone. That was why I have to run after you. Uh, what was the something you thought about? Uh, we have a a perfect opportunity that if we utilize it very well, we will achieve what we want. And what is the perfect opportunity? Good. Uh, you see, uh, the prince has gone astray in the eyes of everyone. Uh, and um, if we use your daughter uh, to marry the prince, uh, then um, we can achieve what we want. Uh, well, uh, that sounds good. But how does my daughter is in uh, marrying the prince solve the situation? Uh, because we had planned of wiping the king's lineage. So, why bring in marriage? Hey, if you, if you use your head, eh, don't you remember that it's the rat in the house that knows the easiest route to the storehouse? Don't you know? <laughs> oh, no, <woo. laughs> oh, no, no, we are too much. <laughs> you do book is within Yes, it's from there, you know now. Eat. Eat. We shall honor the king's invitation. Yes. With um, one of our uniforms, of course. Oh, well, yes, yes, okay. I don't know which one you have to prefer, but look at these ones. Mm. We can choose from any of them. Mm. Okay, this one, is also, this one is good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. See this one? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I had that in mind too. Mm -hmm. Ah, well, let me hear them. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Ah. Wait. I want to this myself. Ah, okay. Okay. Please. Use the toilet inside now. Where, where are you going? Uh, no, when I'm on a high spirit like this, I prefer the open air to the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Do not kill the crops in my garden, no, please. <laughs> with, your, with, with that, you are seed. <laughs> Phone beans. Oh no. You knew all along that your daughter's pregnancy was fake. And you didn't have the conscience to confess. You were evil. My king, that means that Ezine's pregnancy is also fake. No, no, no. 
Ezinez's pregnancy is real. Very real. That was why Ono became very envious about it. He even told me to tell Ezinez to get rid of the pregnancy. Yeah. But I refused. Yes. Was it the plan for her to, to get pregnant? You, you expect me to sit down and watch the prince marry Ezinez honorably after messing up with my daughter? Just just look at look at both of you. How shameless. My, my thing, what are we going to do to these two shameless fools? Promise is already on his way here with some policemen. Oh, huh. Let's blow text his mouth. I am a le, I am a le. Mama le, mama le 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 le. Not saying anything, your brother in law? I mean, he got attacked. Oh, got it. Yeah. Uh, you have to be very careful out there, yeah? Oh, sure, sure. Uh, I'll be lucky this time. <laughs> yeah, I'll be lucky next time. Yeah, well, so, be very careful. Bye. I'm almost see you now. Yeah, take care. Bye. Bye, bye, my love. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> Isn't it you're coming to the hospital with me for mental paternal testing, PPT, so I can clear my head from this pregnancy bullshit? I am not going anywhere with you. If I leave this place, isn't it? If I venture away this place, I won't be responsible for this kid and the welfare of that baby. I will not be. I wonder what you're even doing here in the first place. My baby and I are doing well without you. So we would be when he is born. Another he. So, um, so you girls think because um, I need an heir to the children, uh, you can just keep bringing he, 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 I think I will accept any of you. Huh? I learned you a fool. What? I just confirmed that now. Stop insulting me, isn't it? The prince with no crown. If I were you, I would lock myself inside my room instead of moving around with no shame. Like you do. Isn't it? I want to have you in 
insult me. With no apology, dear ex-lover, get out of my father's house. I do not need you in my life, neither my own child. Out of my father's house. I do not owe you, nor anyone, a proof. So this minute, get out of my house. Leave! Leave this minute! You are good. Andy, what is the problem? I don't want to leave here. You relax. Okay, this is your father's house. This is crazy. Mm -hmm. I want to go. Come on. for crying out loud, you and I know that we cannot go back home now. Our lives are in danger. I will beg my paper the person that wants to kill you to leave me alone. And you thanks for your concern, but I'd suggest we let the police do their job. Let them carry out their investigations and probably arrest the person. Jay. Yes. Will you marry me? Okay, uh, husband, wife. Yes, I know husband and wife, but this time around, I want to make this decision by myself and nobody else's in intervention. What will you say? Say yes, you marry me. Oh, yeah. Greetings, my princess. Greetings, Mr. Godwin. The queen asks that you come downstairs for dinner. Thank you, Grace. We'll be out in five minutes. Okay, sir. Come on, baby. Let's go have food. Let's go have dinner. Don't want to be here. What's the matter? What is it, my love? I want to go home. I want to go home. Take me home. I, I hate being here. I, I'll tell you, but you will not listen to me. Look 
of you and this family picture will be a problem. How can you say that? Is she not a member of the family? Seriously? Are you going to hand this picture that this guy did not hand her like a car? In a big family picture? Stop, stop! What nonsense is this? What nonsense is this? My queen, the princess wanted to see a movie, but the decoder in her room has an unstable network. That is why I had to bring her here. Are you stupid? Sorry, my queen. What if I had walked in here with some visitors? So she can ask me as she always does? Is that what you want? Henceforth. She's not allowed to leave the four corners of her room. If she wants anything, tell Promise, and he will make sure it is available for her. Don't try this. Okay, my You turn me like a slave. I need like a prisoner. I I need like a place in my own father's house. I saw the memory I have of this house as such one. I, I do not remember many good things that my mother did for me. My princess, I'm really sorry. I'm sorry, please. I do not was hurting you by those actions. I'm truly sorry from the bottom of my heart. Uh, I think you were doing there was wrong, wrong. I didn't know how to correct you with peace and love. Please, my darling, my princess, I love you from the bottom of my heart. I am so sorry. Please forgive me. Please. I can, I can make amends. Please. I, I love you. Too. I, I, I love you. Thank you so much. I will never leave. I will show you love. I will be there. I will be with you. I will be there. I haven't done. I will do everything now. Please. Please. It's okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you. So, what, 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 what was your urgent call for? Yeah, my prince, I'm sorry for bringing you out um, this early. But we got information that the idiot is now in the palace, so we've made up our mind to invade the palace and silence the monster for all. Yeah, that's what's going 
you are the seal like this. If you give me permission, if I enter that palace, I will put that book on down. No, 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 I don't understand. You mean the job I gave to you, you couldn't carry out outside now? The guys in the palace and what come to the palace and invade the palace? Is that what you want to do? Oh, Baba, we feel what I'm there. Anyways, anyway. Baba, two seconds. Everywhere go, boss. Listen to me. Go and carry out what I paid for. Okay? And I don't want to see you anywhere close to the palace. So just go get a job done. The tussle for power, fortune, and fame is bringing so much pain and shame. All, all for selfish gain. It's a shame, a big shame. The effort some people put into planning and plotting of this evil. So <coughs> the king's cabinet. All for selfish needs. They are selecting who is going to replace or no. And the way for today. Father asked them not to allow me to come inside. Yes. They don't really care. As long as they get what they no. I heard of the meeting yesterday or last night. I mean, I came to your to your room but you refused to open the door to talk to me i will not let anyone take what rightfully belongs to me i will not let them take my bed right from me so he actually took God inside the room to replace you with such an important meeting. Never is a mention my husband's name. Your husband wants to take my bed right away from me, and I will not let him do that. He has not done anything to anybody. You need to talk to him. Mother, please do. Because it can never happen. It will not happen. I will not allow anyone to take my bed right. What rightfully belongs to me. Will you just stop that? I sincerely hope that you understand all that I'm about to say to you right now. Okay. The truth is, I love you. I just find it weird being with you. It's not my fault that I am like this. I did not create myself. Of course, I know you did not create yourself, which is why I love you regardless. I love you. You are a blessing to my life. I, I just realized that I can't imagine the multiple blessings you brought into my life, barely a year of just knowing you. Now. Celebrity. Yes, I am now a celebrity all thanks to you and G. 
Ji heads forth. I will love and care for you. You will experience true happiness. I love you. And I'm sorry, Ji. is going too far into this music team. That is why we call for this meeting. Can you be more explicit? Your Highness, how can our king in line be jumping around in shows and parties? No, 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 Your Highness. He should be cautioned. Uh, my king, just the other day I was watching a program on television. I saw him dancing around with naked girls. It's not proper for an incoming king. Your Highness, I also think he should stop this music thing before he brings Rediko to himself. Godwin. Yes, my king. Have, Have you, you heard, heard the council? council? Clearly, my king. Good. What, what do, do you have, have to say? say? My king and uh, my father's. I implore you to please reinstate Prince Chidi as the crown prince. I don't want to be king. I want to pursue my music career to the highest level. Are you saying that you're relinquishing your position as the king in line? I beg for you for this. To fulfill you. Everyone deserves a second chance. the facility doctor that I mentioned earlier. Okay, thank you so much, my son. Thank you. Do you have with them? Uh, they want to help me with money to start up my plumbing business. Mm. So they want to help me. Please stop going to them. I will personally talk to the queen. She will give you the money and she can take it from my salary. Please don't ever go to them again. Pico. I forbid you from doing that. You want the queen to start looking down on me, or what? What do you mean the queen will start looking down on you? Money is money. Let her give you the money. Please. <laughs> Special advisor in monetary matters. I will see my fellow men and they will help me. So don't bother yourself. Mm. Yes? Ha! So you 
give up a title that existed in your lineage even before you were born just for a mere 7 million naira shut up 7 million naira is not just have you counted 1 million naira before talk more of 7 million naira hey, i know i might not have counted millions before in my life but to see this thing that you've done I mean, I cannot do it. <laughs> I cannot do it. Man, me uh, eh? You don't understand. Those men are people with money. I may come from the lineage of lawmakers, but they are the true owner of power when it comes to Kaneku politics. And how do you mean? <laughs> with their money and their fluence. They can do anything. I thought that they were just being cautious to have asked me nicely. They can take it by force if they want to. It's not true. It's not true. Everybody knows that they know who title is hereditary. Hmm. So they can't take it by force. It's uh, not true. Uh, you don't know anything. Go and put this thing in my purse. First thing tomorrow morning, I'm going to transfer, transfer the money into my account before going to see the king with them in the afternoon. You go up, you go and show up. Go. You will start your own business. I will start my own business. Le, so you mean? Obuefi, I don't know who are responsible for my father's death. I suspected so because they were the last people to be seen with him. And I don't think any other person would have been interested in having your father dead. Yes. So what about the money? Did you give it back to them? The money is in your father's account. They didn't come back for it and um, I didn't ask any questions either. Okay, so we, we have such money lying in the bank and you allowed us to suffer this much? Who does that to me? My son, I tried to go to the bank to get the money. But they wouldn't let me. They told me that you're the only one that can access the account because your father used you as his next of kin. So why didn't you take me there? All this while. At least our lives would have been, wouldn't have been this terrible before I made it into the music industry. I'm sorry that I have to find out this way. And also I was scared that you would squander the money knowing how desperate you were to shoot your musical video. I didn't want you to squander the money. So, um, I'm really sorry about everything. But the money is there. It's still there. It's okay, Le. It's okay. Um, thank you for being there for us. Thank you for laboring so hard and slaving to ensure that we had the little we had. And thank you too for being such an obedient and a loyal son. You made motherhood so easy for me. Thank you all. And I pray to God Almighty that he gives you loyal and obedient children too. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, hey, hey, God, you know one more thing. Yes, Please, don't ever ask the king about this owner with him. Let it go. I believe you're still going to have a good life. Hmm? Let's just be between us. I just wanted you to know how your father died. Let it go, please. All is in the past now. Hmm? Jide 
Africa is all I need and ever wanted in my life. That is why I married her. The marriage in that video was over the day I made up my mind to spend the rest of my life with her. declaration about me being the next king in line. It's really affected my career. I haven't stopped you from practicing your career. Just be decent about it as a royal personality. Uh, but my king, um, I'll be attending shows and concerts to get up there. Godwin. Yes, my king. Go ahead and do your music. I'm still alive. I still have more days to spend on Earth. My ancestors are not calling yet. By the time they start calling, you will have had enough time to practice your career. Is that okay? Um, my king, I'm very sorry to bring this up, but please, I beg of you, reinstate Prince Chidi. It is his birthright. Any desperate mind would do anything to keep it. Has he come to threaten you? Well, no, my king, but ever since you made the declaration, we have not been in talking terms. So you are asking me to reinstate him because you feel threatened by his action? I am Prince Chidi. We've not been in talking terms ever since you made that declaration. So are you asking me to reinstate him because you feel threatened by his action? No, oh, my king. I am only saying that Prince Chidi is your only son and I know you wish him well. I will help him become a better person that the Council of Elders will see this and only if you will have mercy and reinstate him. <sighs> All right, go ahead and render the help. Let's see how it goes. Thank you, my king. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 
I am very sure that the royal household will be happy to hear this news. <laughs> but before we, 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 tears. Um, okay. Yes, baby. I was able to access the money in my late father's account. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> and guess what? Because of the good news that has been flying around, I am going to get you a car. Oh, yes. How about you, a car and also employ a driver that will be taking you anywhere you want to go to? Oh, my God! <laughs> yes, baby. <laughs> Easy, baby. Mm -hmm. mm. Easy. Easy. That's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you happy for me, right? Mm -hmm. And wait, let me, let, me, let me say hello to my baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How are you doing in there? He's gonna be a boy. He's gonna be a boy. Oh, the baby's gonna be a boy. <laughs> you no, know, no, 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 I disagree. A boy. <laughs> baby, I'm so happy. God has been faithful, you know? Yeah. <laughs> What do you mean she refuses to come with the baby? Mom said she refused to come with the baby. And as in I said, she and her baby have nothing to do with the royal household. And that she's going to take care of the hospital bill herself. I understand she's hurt, but she can't stop us from seeing the baby. Anyway, um, I'll handle it, alright? I don't blame the poor girl. I mean, you publicly denied having any intimacy with her whatsoever. What do you expect her to do? There's no need for us to trade any blames now. Um, I'll take care of it. I'm sure she might need some form of assurance from me. Chief Okonkwo. Chief Mezier. My king. You are no strangers to the happenings in this palace. You all are aware of what has happened between Prince and Izinne and how the young girl is hurting because the prince denied her publicly. He denied ever having any intimacy with her publicly. And she is hurting. I already promised the prince that I will talk to her personally. So I want you to go and see her. Tell her that you're coming personally from me and that I'm aware of everything that has happened, that she should come. Consider it done, my king. Thank you. Uh, and the boy and I say, I'm going to go to the hospital. 
Especially as a child is already involved. Yes. And at the same time, uh, we thank God that our son, the prince, has turned the new leaf. Correct. All right. Let's drink to the success of your mission. Isn't it? I want to thank you for at least for staying here with the baby. Thank you very much. I shouldn't have said those words I said to you the other night. I I wasn't meant to say them. Uh, but my, 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 my ego, the pride in me wouldn't let me come back and apologize to you. I'm sorry. Chide, I carried your child in my womb for good nine months. I will never care how I was coping without my father. My father died in the prison, but you never came to see me. I did. I came, but you never gave me that audience. You only came for PPT. To the hour on earth were you expecting me to jump into the car and go, go with you to God knows where? That was the same day I was hospitalized. Everyone came visiting. Everyone. I was just looking out for you. But you never came. It's okay. All that is in the past now. Isn't it? That is by the way. Isn't it? I know deep down in you, you still feel something for me. Deep down in your heart, you do. That's because you knew how deep I was in love with you. But your promiscuous life wouldn't let you stay with one woman. What we had, what we shared, are still on people's lips everywhere. Everyone still talk about it. You remember our childhood days? How we play and go everywhere like childhood lovers. You still remember? Chidi, you hurt me. Chibi, you hurt me so much. I, I want to forgive you. But, the pain is, the pain still lingers in my heart. I feel so much grief. The grief is it's just too much. Sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm 
sorry for everything I made you pass through. And I promise you, I promise you that I will never, ever hold you again. It's a promise, okay? I'm sorry for everything. Everything. How's my child? How is it doing? It's fine. He's upstairs. Sleeping. Thank you. Sorry, okay? It's alright. I love you. I love you so much. Some wine and toasts. Yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. Yeah, easy, easy. Okay. Um, there we go. Um, mm -hmm. You have to eat your cake, eh? No. <laughs> have a taste of your cake. Oh. Uh, there you go, baby. Easy, easy, easy. Ah! <laughs> Cheers, baby. Mm -hmm. To us. <laughs> to us. <laughs> now, take a sip. Take a sip, baby. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's, that's okay. That's okay. Hip, hip, hip! Hip, hip! <laughs> hip, hip, hip! Hip, hip! <laughs> yeah, bless it. Yeah. Take a sip again, baby. Take a sip. with overwhelming evidence. Prince Chidi has turned a new leaf. And we are all witnesses to the transformation that has taken place in him. It gives us a great deal of joy. In agreement with the Queen and the Council of Elders, it gives me a great deal of pleasure to reinstate you, Prince Chidi, as the Crown Prince of Kaneku Land. With all the accompanying rights and privileges and the authority that that position commands. Iwe. So I will call on the Ono Your Highness. to hand over to him his staff of office. Your Highness. May you live long, Your Highness. He My said, Prince. The King has spoken, and so shall it be. I hereby hand over your staff. He said, It shall be well with you. Yeah. Mono. Yeah. Zonu. Yeah. Zonu. Yeah. Zonu. Yeah. Zonu. Yeah. Congratulations, my 
it is well with you, my son. You go ahead and do the dancing. We are excited. Oh, yes, yes. This is great news. I am happy. Thank you, my queen. Oh, Jesus. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm now a fulfilled woman. Mm. <laughs> Godwin, congratulations. Thank you, my king. Thank you. This is this is this is great news indeed. Yes. Awesome. Like I said, mother and child going fine. Hey. <laughs> oh yes, you can tell. Yes, mother and child are doing fine. Yes, my king. Ah, this is good to know. Oh. oh. Uh, yes, my queen. Case, my oh, oh, she's doing fine. My she's doing fine. Where with him? <laughs> Amugo has started already. <laughs> <laughs> you can say that again, my king. Yes. <laughs> Your grandchild. Your grandchild. Njideka. <laughs> oh, yes. God is great. For power, fortune, and fame is bringing so much pain and shame. All, all for selfish gain. It's a shame, a big shame. The effort some people put into planning and plotting of this evil is so appalling. <laughs> 